to hello everybody it is wednesday off the rails you know what it is may 17th okay let's go <laughs> sponsored today by express vpn thank you so much we love them well we've got a quite a show here and you know okay all right the um, original was that an original music uh song no that was uh, a nook uh oh that was a nookie yeah it was a nook. i did it all for the anookie <laughs> sure yeah <laughs> that was uh <laughs> take me home country road and i, oh, I, just, I pitched him up when oh he, yeah. wow yeah, so. well done thank you well welcome everybody skinny ethan here <laughs> i look i feel that i look skinnier I'm seeing myself in the previewer. Definitely. I, I'm feeling it, finally. Yeah. Girlie, you do. You've been. I've yeah. been. I promise. Slay. It's nice, though. Oh, I got all these fitness guys apologizing to me now. <laughs> I finally respect him again. Yeah, we gotta actually, if you stack up this one against all the other shows we've done, this one that we've got here today is gonna stack up fairly well. Right in the middle of the road. It's a pretty good one, I think. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Well, I'll tell you what we've got planned. Sam, Samantha, if I may. Actually, <laughs> may I? <laughs> oh, Kim it's, it's, fine. it's fine. My whole government. Your government, whole government name? name? Hey, so actually, Sam is a couple of points of contention. So first of all, actually, three points of contention I have with you, Sam, today. Okay. <clears throat> well, so first of all, Fika Fish, as you guys know, Sum Stroman, the most disgusting, stinky, vile shit out of Sweden that we've eaten a few times on this show. It's been discontinued. No longer making it because of overfishing. Thank God. Wow. This is the first. Not enough herring in the sea. Cool. You know, I never thought I'd say this, but overfishing good? I mean... Less feet, less Sum Stroman. That's a dub for humanity. But we have like, we had like two or three of the last cans on Earth, which we had to go through extreme measures to gather. Sam has taken it upon herself, because we've eaten it so many times disgustingly, but we said, you know, let's prepare it the traditional way that the Swedes do, because love is always telling us, no, you got to do it this way. You got to open it underwater. You got to open it outside. You got to boil the fish and then put it on whatever <laughs> you know you got me <laughs> <laughs> and uh so we said okay let's try to make this shit delicious because apparently some of y'all out there like this shit so that's what sam's done how many dishes have you prepared for us i've prepared it four ways four ways nice good for you so that's the first thing we're going to be doing and that's exciting i guess Man! The second one is that there was a, I saw this video and I sent it to the gang because I thought it was so incredible. And then Sam starts calling me out. Where is this fucking video? Where, where, what number is it? Here it is. This man, check this out. Uh, there's been a whole debate in the office about is this real or fake? Uh, oh, I guess I won't play the music, but. Here it is. I got it. I turned it down. So this man is obviously a pizza dough. Uh, I mean, he's the best in the world. Who does that? It floats. That bitch floats. And then, well, here's the craziest part. That. You know. Now. <clears throat> now, I don't know if it's real or fake, but I, I swear to God, I'm learning towards real. 
And then, but the no problem is, then Sam goes, oh, it's definitely fake. I says, well, you can do that with a Frisbee. You can do that. She goes, a Frisbee's not a boomerang. I says, no, you can do that. So she's doubting if it's even possible. That is so fake, Ethan. When he throws it and it comes back, that is so fake. Okay, hold on. First of all, Sam says, you can't even do that with a Frisbee. That's ridiculous. Are you standing behind that still? I, I don't think you can do that with a Frisbee. Jeez, man. I can't believe you would say that. I would love I, to be proved wrong. Yeah, I I think you guys never been maybe to a park. It can be done the with a frisbee. I don't think you can show us today. Okay, well then that's the second part. Like that's what I'm saying. The third part. I definitely can do this. <laughs> I don't know if I can. <laughs> Sorry. How many times are you guys gonna doubt my athleticism? Every time you guys stepped up to me as an athlete, I have. I told you when you got here and we were talking about this that I actually believe in. <laughs> in you and with this one. Thank with you, this Dan. One. I'm yeah. stepping up you know, to you as an athlete You have the credentials. You, you're no a dad. Experience. You wear shorts yeah, dude. with socks and slides, okay? This is, he has all of the frisbee credentials. <laughs> and he went to Santa Cruz. And he went to Thank Santa you, Cruz. ABs Most importantly. Sam goes, right. oh, I played, I played uh, ultimate frisbee once or twice. I said, I went to U, U, USC, USC, UCSC. Bro, <laughs> you're wrong a lot today. <laughs> You okay. know, frisbee. Um, Ultimate frisbee is the it's the national sport in that city. Mm -hmm. that the national sport. Know, I, the I, it's the municipal the sport. I am the office kind of doubter. I always doubt shit. Always to like a annoying extent. Mm -hmm. But I think this is real, and I think it's possible with a frisbee. I think it's possible with a doe. Wow. I'm totally with you. He's oh my god! Okay, in. that's big. He's all in. Yeah, that's big. So the the only problem here is obviously. We have a pretty tall roof here, but not that tall. What do you think? That's like 20 feet, maybe? I mean, you, yeah. need, to, you need to throw it pretty high. Mm -hmm. But I'm confident that I can at least demonstrate that it goes up and comes back down. It won't be perfect with this low roof situation. Mm -hmm. 37 but I, feet of cement posted. But I, I can demonstrate it to you. If we go outside, I could do it easily. Easily. Yeah, first try. Easily. I don't understand how you can even first doubt try? that. I'm not doubting. Just First go to YouTube try? and type for it. I mean, what the hell, dude? We're on YouTube. <laughs> this is this is the YouTube video you, you look up. We're about to make it. Mm -hmm. But you know what? I'm. Wa what do you think is fake about this? Go ahead, Sam. About the dough? Yeah, about the dough, dough boy. Dough doesn't do that. If it's, you, you're telling me if you throw pizza dough, it will boomerang back to you. It, if it's light enough. I don't... No, I don't think that that's real. Because clearly the dough, he, he's a master at creating this really thin, light dough. And at a certain point, Sam, I don't know if you know anything about air resistance and velocity and weight. <laughs> you know about air what? resistance. Mm. But like, look how it glides down. Do you think that's fake? Like when he glides it here, is it all fake? Or this part real? real? I, I think when he's holding it and that. doing his little tricks, that is real. When he so okay. Throws it though. If this man is happening and it's not, that's not, <clears throat> not real. If this man can create a gliding pizza right there before your eyes, he can do the frisbee trick. Mm. <clears throat> it's clearly light enough to float down. Yeah, this is not pizza, by the way. I don't think. I think oh, this is some kind of, uh, maybe um, like a crazy pastry. Oh, yeah. maybe you're right, actually. Mm. Does that change? Now, that might no. change things if Why? it's not pizza dough. It's dough. What well, does I it matter? I feel like it depends on what kind of, is it rice flour go. dough? There we go. There we go. Is mm. it almond flour dough? Mm. That looks like flour. Weights. That's mm. flour. Dude, he tosses that thing like Captain America's shield. Yeah, dude. That guy, he's the man. Dude, this guy's the man. Good fuck. <clears throat> When he's doing that, I don't think the people in the back are following the pizza though. With their, you would think it's, they would. That's oh. that's what I was gonna say. Oh, is yeah. when he catches it, they don't really react. Huh? Oh. Watch, right watch the people in the back. When he catches yeah. it. Like if I mm, saw that good. shit, I'd be like, what? "Homie with the bowl cut back there." No, oh, there's his head turned. I don't know. Okay, first of all, I don't know how long they've been watching him, but I mean, they maybe. do react. They're loving it. They dude. Been, the first time I saw mm. that, I was like, "Oh my god, magic!" If that's real. Me too. I sent it to you guys. So, I was so why shocked. are all of these people just like? Mm. And it happened in front of them. I was watching it on TikTok. 
Mm. I don't know what to tell you guys. I think I you're think living it, in a and you're living in denial. I think it's a that crepe. great men like this exist. You think it's a crepe? I think it's a crepe. Mm -hmm. Okay, does crepes that change your analysis? Um, and crepes fly. Like yeah, yes, crepes can fly, but people can't. Oh, interesting. It, it, it changes okay. a little bit because a crepe is a le is less elastic than dough. You think dough would separate? That's kind of fair. Kind I don't fair. believe that it's crepe is different. If you if you were to fling I'm dough sorry. like that, it would stretch the whole the whole shape would listen. Change. If agreed. Clearly, you've never flung, you need flung dough. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you're in a world where dough can fly or it can't fly. I don't know why you're why you're hedging your statements now. I live in can the world dough where fly? dough can't fly. You say dough cannot fly. Sam, right. But Sam now says dough can fly. A crepe might be able to fly. <gasps> dough can fly, you said. Show me the wings. Well, yeah, but not like that. But now like, that you, you know, when pizza's like thrown up and like when like when he's holding it, when it's around him that is possible with dough i think he has no pizza experience <laughs> yeah yeah you might have crepe experience <clears throat> if it is fake it's one of those videos where like why would they fake that there uh, and that's a good point the people's heads don't even follow they're not even looking mm -hmm. <clears throat> they don't even the follow camera. when the dough flies okay away. wrong 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 there's wrong. an orb that like wrong, goes wrong, up wrong. when he tosses it, and it stays on the screen. But I wonder what that means. <clears throat> hold on. I'd like to look at that one more time. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. There's a man wrong. here on the right. You can't see many faces because the camera pans so fast. But watch this guy in the bottom right. Where's wrong. his head? Where's his head? Look at the people in back. This old lady is looking up. What's she looking at? Is she in on it too? Wrong. Look at her. Look at her. Look at the boy on the bike. What is he a plant? <laughs> I can't see the boy on the bike. I, can. I don't know what you're pointing I can. At. He's looking up. Is he? Is yeah. there even a person on that bike? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> that little boy is on the bike and he's looking up. He's I don't know. He's having the time you. of his life, okay? What about this lady? This lady, this guy. Where are they looking? This guy right here. Everybody's looking at the pizza. So that was the guy throwing Wait, the right. pizza. Okay, the bowl cut <laughs> is the guy that I would have my eyes on though. Because he yeah. was looking to the side, and then he follows back. So, I don't know. Um, he does seem to be watching. There are smiles. Uh, I do not often agree with things being real, but may I introduce uh, another proof uh, that it's real? Go ahead. Yeah, I oh, can't. we have some more evidence. I, I don't go out and, like, tarnish my reputation saying stuff is real. Right. If I'm yeah, not no. sure. You're the ultimate hater. Yeah, I'm the ultimate hater. And this video that I just sent in the Discord... Kind of, in my opinion, proves that this is a thing. And this is your American mindset now. You're optimistic. This is an art. Uh, right. I don't know what country. Do you, does anyone know what country this takes place in? No, it looks like Chinese. I think this yeah, is a chi an ancient Chinese art of uh, of uh, pastry flinging. Yeah, and I agree with Sam. It's probably that man like just, a crepe. That man just did it, dude. There's like a whole ass group of people who are just throwing crisps. <laughs> it's an ancient Chinese art form, you're these, right. These dudes are just throwing <laughs> yeah. crepes like there ain't no tomorrow. Right. You go, and you see this on any street corner in China, people just tossing crepes. <laughs> yeah. They're also just kind of, you know, in like, uh, <clears throat> you know, like Crouching Tiger, like how they float like they're on wires or whatever. Absolutely. They're just like dancing <clears throat> acrobatically through the streets, tossing pizza around. Absolutely. It's in the Beautiful ancient sides. text. <clears throat> yeah, it's definitely a crepe though. But, uh, what's going on in his face? What is he wearing? Wait, what's going on with this guy's face? Because he's, like, able to look? He can, like, look. So it's not a full-on mask. Oh, I'm being told that's his actual, that's his actual face. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> so, Sam, I don't know. Uh... Well, we can settle the frisbee part right now. <clears throat> but okay, if you think a crepe dough can do this, then you're I admitting a, a frisbee can do could, it. I don't know. I a frisbee might be able to do it. I don't think you can do it. Oh, I see. So you're Here's you're every you're moving the goalpost every <laughs> time I ask. Flight shift. Oh, okay. So well, <sighs> let me find you uh, frisbee frisbee uh, boomerang. I don't know how else to say it, but you'll see. Yeah. Why are you looking There's at There's videos it? out there. I thought you were going to demonstrate for it. Well, because Sam was saying, first of all, it's not I, possible. I thought you knew how to do it. I can do it. Yeah, Chill the fuck out. Mm. Damn. Boomer. I don't know. I feel like you haven't gotten up yet. You know, I went out on a limb and said I believed in you, Ethan, and now you kind of... Here. You're going to be pulling back a little bit. 
boomerang. Let's do it. Combo wombo. Combo wombo. No, but just look what this guy can do. You see how far he chucked that? Coming right back to him. Ooh. Bam. And and you know. You could see that. Yo, we he fucking you. crushed that, bro. You could see that in every park in America. Now, can I do it? Absolutely. It's so easy. You could do it. You want me to try to do it right here in this low ass roof? Hmm. Let's take a poll first. I want to know if the people it's think not it's easy. if it's what real or the not. Pole? Is the pe is the dough flinging real or fake? Dough flinging. Also, when I came in, Cameron was like, "Yo, it's fake, dude." So I I took a lot of heat here for for backing up my dough boy. I'm I'm starting to change my mind. I think. Okay. Yeah. I, did I'm you see that heat? I dropped the second angle <laughs> in the um Discord there. This is like who shot JFK. The second angle from the same guy. Our oh second shit! Video completely. Oh shit! There was more than one video taken. But then okay. that would make it like impossible. Oh to... wow! This is this is. The... That's compelling. Maybe. He did it again. That was a different In slow throw. Too. <clears throat> That's two 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 more tries. Also, to fake video. it from two different angles would be nuts. Wow, he, good for him. He's very talented. Then. I would like to That's issue. All you have to say. A formal apology <laughs> to you, Ethan. So <laughs> talented, it's crazy. Thank you, Cameron. Mm -hmm. He is flinging dough. That man's flinging dough. Sure is. Okay, so let's do a poll real fast, and then I'll demonstrate my skill. Pulls uh, up. Uh, it's about seventy-five percent real. About a quarter of the audience is still doubting, though. I'm actually surprised that there's still a quarter of you doubting. The real question is, does it affect the taste? Although people are saying it's a bad pull. That's that's on you. You know what? You I got take hit that personally. I got hit with my first bad pull on Tuesday. Good. But they were right. <laughs> it could always be clearer. That being said, this one's pretty clear. I don't know what how this one seems could be like bad. a perfect pull. Is the fling real Let's or fake? Honest. Real, fake. I mean, I don't know how you could mistake that. Amazing pull. All right, let's do it. Let's see what do I can it? do. You ready? This. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> All right. I'm stepping into the demonstration tank, where I'll be throwing a frisbee. Let me know if you get it. Yep. Up. Okay. They are walking yeah, over. over. Dan is not <laughs> camera operation. I'll be your ball boy. They can hear me. Yeah. Okay. So I gotta find. Again, you can see I'm inside, so it's not. But basically, the strategy is. You know, I'm gonna try to throw it up for to that corner, the height corner there, to give just enough space. I'm not gonna be able to do a full return. You saw how far that guy bombed it. Mm -hmm. But what I'm hoping yeah, to demonstrate here today to silence the haters is that I can it will return back to me a little bit. It will change direction. Okay? So with all that being said, I'm in my shorts, I'm in my sandals, I'm in my socks, as Dan noted. I'll try again, but you, it was going. Okay, here we go, one more time, because it hit the roof. It, 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 you can't really do it in here. <laughs> it's a tiny roof! Here, let me try it like... Yeah. You, you see it's coming back. I'll go outside <laughs> if you need me to, Sam. It's easy, right? <laughs> There it is. It comes back. Ooh. I mean, I don't know. I, yeah. Okay. Hey, English. Now you guys are just watching two grown men play frisbee <laughs> inside. All right. Let's see. You see? I mean, it's coming back. Is it not coming back? It's coming back that way. No. Nope. Uh, did I did I pass, Dan? You tell me. Can I try it? Yeah. I, 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 yeah. I, I, just I'm like the man with the dough. Yeah. Yeah. That was coming back. Oh my god, alright. Nope. Here we go. Chat saying he looks skinny. Here, you want to get it from this angle, Dan? It needs to go really high. The point is, at a certain, it's the height that makes it reverse motion. Dude, if I, if I couldn't do it, could I really do this? Fuck, I used to be able to do this. <laughs> Fuck. 
Okay, dude. If, could I do that? Bring it here. Nope. I'll throw a fucking heater at you, boy. I'll catch it. I don't want to hurt you. I could throw it that hard. I can take it. <laughs> don't hit love bone. Are you serious? No, 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 no. It'll hurt you. It'll hurt you. I got insurance. You pay my health insurance. I don't. I can't do it. You put on a glove. I'm telling you, it's going to be a heater, bro. Just do it. Just do it. Eat it up. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, wait, you got this, you put a fucking dent in this. <laughs> you didn't want you didn't want to catch that. Look at that though, you put a fucking dent in Come here, Dan. There it is. That would have been my fucking hand. Yeah, you you don't want to catch that. Yeah, damn. It's indented, you guys. Thank you, Cameron. Yeah, thank you. Uh, uh you know, uh, I saw it come back a little bit. Come on. I did. I did. <laughs> Uh, come on, I gotta prove my credentials here. <sighs> right? We have dough as well. Oh yeah, let's try it with the dough now. But again, if I can't do it with the fr bring out the dough, bring out the dough. I'm doing it with the dough. It's not a, people are saying it's about the wind. It's not about the wind, it's about the the angle of attack. It's all about the respect. Can we even go outside? It wouldn't really. Yeah, You're we don't hit a car yeah. if we go outside. Yeah. I don't think we can go outside. Okay, bringing out the dough. Thank you, girl. So this is pizza dough. As so, I agree with you, Sam. It's not pizza dough. This is too heavy. Yeah, I think it, it could be possible if it was a crepe, because it's not as elastic, and a crepe is made from a batter, not a dough. Huh? What's the difference? Batter is, like, thinner than dough. Batter? And also the thinner thing... Thinner than dough? You can see the, um, the big round thing in front of him, I think, is like the crepe grill. That's for sure. No, it's a crepe. Yeah, It is yeah. for sure a crepe. Can I get a roller or something? Roll it. This bitch about to fly. I don't give a fuck. You understand? Some flour too. I'm gonna make this fly right now. Roll it. <laughs> Roll it. Team stars. On the edge ready. of his seat. Always ready. Yeah, this is too uh and in the roll. <laughs> it's too sticky. Hmm. A lint roller? Okay. A, r a lint roller. <laughs> well, Come get a shot of this, guys. Yeah, 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 oh, yeah, there you go. yeah, yeah, yeah. Smart. There we go. Thank you. Vodka with natural flavors. Okay, well, you guys, can you get a shot of this? All different flavors. I think I need flour to roll this properly. Otherwise, it's just gonna stick. You know. Do we have flour? Someone in chat said, "What is this podcast about?" <laughs> it's about making memories. About, about nothing. In the Seinfeld. Uh, I cannot flatten this fucking dough. It just, just sucks. Well, let me try the lint roller at least. Oh, <laughs> it's, it's just not disgusting. that bad. But look how, look how sticky it is. It just shrinks. It's like, it's like your penis in the cold water. Like just this. like it. Thanks. Well, I'll tell you one thing. There ain't gonna be no lint on it. <laughs> That's some clean Hell dough yeah. right there. I'll tell you what, man. Ain't never seen dough that clean before. Mm-hmm. It's like you're playing with Play-Doh. <laughs> you're making no progress. It's just freaking no, right no, no. back. There is progress. There is. I see it. Okay. I see it. <laughs> I'll tell you what, boy. I ain't Let never seen a dough that flat and that clean. Let him cook. There's progress. Stop shrinking though, damn, what's with this fucking dough? Ethan, it might be easier if you were to pick it up and go around the edge like this. Think so? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And maybe if you did like an Italian accent, it might help too. Like maybe, like maybe you could start spinning it, maybe, to start it letting it Sounds very separate. like uh, fermented. Spin it? I'm not very good at that. In fact, I'm not good at it. Oop, In fact, I have no talent. I've never done it. In a spinning game. 
He has no pizza experience. That's true. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I think I made it smaller. All right, let's try this. Ready? It's just a rock. <laughs> it's just a. It's just a. It's just a ball of dough. <laughs> All right, ready? Ready? <laughs> hey, hold on, I'm gonna try to get it to stick to the rail. One sorry, guys. We're just. We're back. All right, ready, Cam? Yes. <laughs> I'm trying to get it to stick to the roof. <laughs> All right. Not happening. Well, somehow. Oh, AB's got another one. Oh yeah, that one looks good. Thanks, AB. Kind of it low-key came back to you. Yeah, kind of good. Okay, ready? This is the one. Forget about it, huh? Hey, it's a boring. It's some dough on the roof. All right, here comes one. Here comes a heater to your wall. <laughs> That was a good throw. Did it pinch it? I think it did. Yeah. yeah. Or yeah. Stop fucking up this wall, bro. Uh oh. Oh no. Try no. to knock his block off. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> he missed. Alright, alright. <laughs> Show AB. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh shit. You're using the Jesus. I know. The spear of Jesus. Fuck. You really got it on there. Holy shit. <laughs> That'll come down by the end of the show. Okay. Probably, right? Yeah, no, it's like wrapped around the cable. That's actually impressive. How the fuck I know. You Dude, perfect, baby. Okay. Incredible things happen when I. When I pick up a sport. The dough did fly. <laughs> the dough didn't come down. The dough never came down. They say what must go up must come down. Not here. Not in my world. <clears throat> you know, I read a comment once that this is this show is just iCarly for adults, and that's all I think <laughs> about now. I don't know what that means, to be honest. You were talking older millennial Nickelodeon, this is some younger millennial. Yeah, I, I never I mean I've never what is iCarly about? Uh, it was a web show where they did silly shit, like... A web show? One of my favorites. Like our podcast. Yeah, it's like our podcast. They did like, kids. yeah, it was two two best friends and their other friend who did camera. Oh, they, they did like a YouTube show. In their show, they yeah. had a show. The show yeah. is about them doing a show. On the internet. Yeah. That's us, dude. And it's literally just like this. So good. Dude, Perfect is fucking crying right now. And written by Dan Schneider. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Dude, Perfect is literally about their fingers trembling as they're on the delete channel button. Okay, that was fun. Uh, then the other, the next thing I gotta ask you about, Sam, since we're on the topic. Can we do one more? Uh, who has the power to do a poll? Yeah, can you just do, can Ethan Frisbee... Can Ethan Frisbee boomerang? No, obviously I'm not, you know, I can't show my full strength here today. As we are concealed into a finite space. Just send a video when you go home, maybe. Okay. I'd be happy to, actually. Can Ethan Frisbee boomerang, yes or no? How about just Frisbee boomer? Yes, the alpha music. All right, I'm asking the community. Dads rise up. Y'all know that one's real. 
dads rise up. Hit that yes button for dads everywhere. Wait, this is kind of confusing, Paul. Can Ethan Frisbee boomerang? Yes. What's confusing about it? Maybe I'm wrong. I, I thought it was, should say, should Ethan boomerang a Frisbee? Should? No. That's Can. way more confusing. Can I boomerang a Frisbee? Boomer. <laughs> Rather than... <clears throat> All right, well, I, despite 43% haters out in the audience, I'll take the 58% uh, dub. Good lean, yes. I'm going to make a video. Remind me, when I get home, I'm going to do that. And I'm going to bring in the receipts, and then you will all bow before me as the ultimate dad. <clears throat> Thank you. All right, we are exactly at 30 minutes. Um, so maybe we should do our All right, so <clears throat> let's thank our sponsor and then actually I have another thing Well, I got to ask you. What is this Sam? I'll show it real fast and then we'll get into it uh, Kim Kardashian. What? Yeah, it's Sam on TikTok. Just saying this <laughs> Kim Kardashian <laughs> Kim Kardashian What is happening? Kim Kardashian <laughs> This is my favorite thing so I have questions about that. Me too. Which I'll present. I have answers. After uh, this one sponsor, who I'm going to thank, uh, ExpressVPN. Yes. Going online without ExpressVPN is like changing while leaving your window wide open. Yeah. You might not have anything to hide, but why give random creeps a chance to invade your privacy? That's fair. Close, close the curtains. You know, if you're going to be dick out you know <clears throat> why does everyone need a vpn when you go online without one internet service providers can see every single website you visit and i know you sick fucks out there got a lot to hide <clears throat> they can legally sell this information without your consent to ad companies and tech giants and then they use this data to target you that's actually kind of gnarly Real gnarly. If they have like a full profile about like everything you do on the internet, everything you've done, yep. that's so invasive. The ISP collects and sells your data. Do they really do that? Yep. Yo, that's yep. fucked up. And so here, well, there's a good reason to use ExpressVPN. Here's another one. Browse more anonymously. When you use ExpressVPN, ISPs can't see what you're doing online. Your identity is anonymized. And uh, by their VPN secure server, and also your data is maximum protected. So easy to use. Fire it up on an app, click one button, Bob's your uncle, you're on, you're surfing. Works on all devices, phones, laptops, and even routers, so everyone who shares your Wi-Fi can be protected. I love, uh, I love it because VPNs are really useful for a whole different slew of reasons. Um, but one of them is connecting, you know, if you, if you connect to like, any streaming service from another country via VPN, you get a whole new catalog of content. A lot of stuff is geo-blocked. If you go to like Japan, Netflix, via a VPN, so it thinks you're in Japan, good. So much great content you're gonna find there. Yeah, Studio Ghibli's on there. Probably all kinds of badass animes on there. Uh, also, I used to use, I used to use uh, VPNs when I was a kid to do prank calls. Is that a thing? Probably not something to recommend doing. Is that something you need a VPN to do? I, I suppose you could. <laughs> you know, randomizes your data. Anyway. Secure your online activity by visiting expressvpn.com slash h3 today right now. That's expressvpn.com slash h3. And you get an extra three months for free. Yes, I said that correctly. Three months for free at expressvpn.com slash h3 right now. Thank you. Thank you to our wonderful sponsor, ExpressVPN. Damn. I'm sick. <clears throat> All right. Damn. So, Sam, I'll play one more time and then 
I'll let you uh, take it from there. Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian. Your thoughts. So, this is me practicing <clears throat> my Michaela. How do you say her last name? Nogira? She's a makeup uh, TikToker. And she posted this TikTok a f maybe last week where everyone accuses her of faking her super thick Boston accent. What can I is this the same girl that was in controversy over the fake lashes? Yes. Oh. She sounds like Carrie Fisher. She's getting heat. Yes. And so she was talking about Kim Kardashian's Met Gala look and her accent was just it was like Kim Kardashian had this Oh god. That's the that's the original one. And so she's saying this is real? Kim Kardashian had this absolutely yeah, that's a fake accent. Kim Kardashian. <laughs> I honestly, it sounds a lot like her. It sounds. I've been practicing. Ian can uh, <laughs> confirm. I say this constantly. I thought you were being uh, over the top, but that's literally how she sounds. Kim Kardashian had this. Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Kim Kardashian. <laughs> can we see it in person, Sam? Kim oh. Kardashian. <laughs> Kim Kardashian had this absolute. You gotta Kim get this Kardashian. one. <laughs> you gotta get this one too, Zach. Kim Kardashian had this absolutely stunning, sexy look at the Met Gala, and you can recreate it at home. But <laughs> why do people care if she's faking her accent? Is she just being a character, right? Or did she say she's specifically like, "This is who I am"? Oh. She um says that it's real. Why would she lie about that? She said that because there are old like videos right. of her from when she was a tour guide and at school, exact. and she says that when she was filming those because she doesn't have the accent in it, she was getting rid of it because she was going to be a news broadcaster. So she learned how to not do her accent. Nobody sounds like this. But that's this. her story. Somebody I went to college with uh, grew up with her and said it's a fake accent. Really? Too. Yeah. Whoa. Literally, no. Nobody sounds. Oh, Av, I love what you're seeing back at BTS. <laughs> Did you get it down? Uh, I didn't. I was afraid that thing might kill me if it falls on my head. AB attempted to put the prolapse on a spike. A pike. Kim Kardashian. To get the pizza down, but it wasn't successful. But nobody sounds like this, right? So, I'm going to be using this brush for the majority of this look. Now, with this look, I'm only going to do now one with this look out. foundation. Kim People Kardashian. started using that sound, the Kim Kardashian, showing their, like, pets and babies. And it's always, like, a jump scare. Their oh, baby, like, looks at the oh, camera like, what okay. the fuck? Kim Kardashian had this. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. I like that. You give it a shot, Ethan. Let's hear you. I, I tried. I, I can't get Kim Kardashian. 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 Sam's is really good. Sam's like she's throat singing. Oh, Mongolian throat singing. Yeah. Pack a day smoker for 15 minutes. What it sounds like. Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Here is, I guess, people um, doing the sound. Kim Kardashian has this <laughs> Yeah, that's fucking good. Okay. Look at the Kim Kardashian had this absolutely. Oh, that's funny. Kim Kardashian had this absolutely. <laughs> These poor pets. Let's see this little girl. Kim Kardashian had this absolutely stunning sex. <laughs> Kim Kardashian had this absolutely. <laughs> I guess I got to do one with Shredder. I didn't know that this was all happening out there. Oh, that's good. Kim Kardashian. I get it now. Let's watch one more time with all that in context. Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Kim Kardashian. <laughs> that's good. Kim Kardashian. Yep. You you got it. <laughs> That one was extra good. Now, was this post uh, Fika Fish construction? So, did all the fumes get to your head no, a little bit? I did this like, I don't know, like last week. Oh, okay. And I just sent it to my friend and I was like, I'm, I'm going to post this. This is so <laughs> funny. Kim Kardashian had this. Let's all do it at the same time. Ready? 
Kim Kardashian. And then I'll play it. Ready? Kim Kardashian. <laughs> That's like a fever dream. That's awesome. All right. Well, shout out to uh, Michaela. <laughs> Shout out. Who's Kardashian. giving, who's giving, like, Mo from Simpsons? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I love her tutorials, actually. Kim Kardashian had this absolute... Yes, girl, we love your tutorials. What about the one about her eyelashes? Did you follow that one? I wear that mascara because of that video. Oh! I was like, oh, I wonder if it's, like, actually good. And it was sold out. I couldn't even find oh it. Oh, my God. And, yeah, so ultimately, I think it was probably a good move for uh, L'Oreal. But I love that. So mascara. does it make your eyes as vo as voluminous as she claims? I think so. I think it works huh. really well. And so do you think maybe she wasn't faking it? Oh, I don't know. I think that there was maybe some foul play. Some foul the, uh, play. Yeah. But I do think that it's a great product. There it is. There it is. Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian. <laughs> That's very funny. Okay, good. Excellent. Well, <clears throat> um, <clears throat> Hunger FF's calling at uh, two, friend of the show. Great guy. All around great guy. Top prolapser in the world, by far. And he's calling in today to talk about his new achievement and, uh, uh, Prolapse technology? Yeah, that's fair. Fair way to put it. Wish I could show it to you guys. It's just not worth it, but... We posted it on the Twitter, right? Yeah, it's on you Twitter. Know. If you go back to, I guess, Monday. Yeah. But I'll tell you this. <clears throat> Who wants to try to put that up their butt for the show? <laughs> 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 you know, I, I said on, I'll see how the the prostate exam goes, and we'll go from there. <laughs> on field reporting. I mean, that thing starts. It's like has a square top, <laughs> mm -hmm. and it starts like this thick. Boy, you raising your hand I, to volunteer? No, no. <laughs> I just I just heard the pizza fall or the dough. Oh, oh, yeah. the dough <laughs> fell. <clears throat> Is anyone thinking about pizza since we threw that dough? Just me. I thought pizza gives you diarrhea now. Uh, yeah. What's that have to do with eating it? I'm just saying, man, looking out for you. <laughs> that's later, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. That's a problem for future me. <laughs> so, uh, about our big Teddy Fresh drop tomorrow, about the classics. So, I am wearing this shirt, pocket tee, fresh, Teddy Bear logo. So nice. Oh my God, is that who's wearing that's one today? Not. That crew now looks so nice. Oh, Clean, man. AB's got one. Yeah. Clean as a whistle, boy. What does clean as a whistle mean? Like, what's clean about whistles? The sound they make? Clean. No, you gotta keep a whistle clean. Because it will, um... It won't get blow. dirt and dust in there and won't blow properly. Huh? <laughs> I don't know, I just... Clean as a whistle. Made, made all that up, I don't know. Yeah, but uh, I got the prices here for you guys. This is coming out tomorrow at 10 a.m. And again, this is an historic drop. The prices. This t-shirt is 20 bucks. I mean, where can you even get, like, a nice designer shirt for 20 bucks? With a pocket? That's hot. Nowhere. The sweatshirt that uh, Olivia and AB are wearing is $55. Again. We somehow got, we dropped it, like, 20 bucks on that one. Uh, hats and beanies, 20 bucks. Hoodies, 60 I don't know how much the hoodie bear ears one is, but it's around the same price. That's the most expensive item in the collection is $60 for the hoodie. I think that's the zip up hoodie too. It's more expensive because of the zipper, you know? And we did nice zippers. We did the nicest zippers. Not that cheap shit. It's that YKK zipper. If you guys know what I'm talking about, that's that good shit. If you buy clothes and it doesn't have YKK, they are going cheap on you. That's a fact. Ain't nothing like those YKK zippers. The only time you'll find a better zipper than YKK is if you buy like a Gucci and they have like their own house made, mm -hmm. you know, s stainless steel uh, branded zipper. The house. Yeah, but we did that YKK. You don't go cheap on the zipper. So uh, tomorrow at 10 a.m. I'm very excited about it and I hope you guys enjoy.
Thank you. I think I'm going to be rocking these for a long time. You know? It's perfect. So, uh, Budge, your little, little hunger. The one and only. YKK are cheap? Why are you saying that? You don't know anything about your... Well, you don't know anything, dude. Gurion Miller? How dare you say that? Zippers, uh, zippers were invented in Sweden. Is that right, Yep. Love? Yep. How fantastic. Uh, that's right. Oh. And I agree with you that what you're saying is true. I about, know. About the YKK? Yeah. Oh, you know about you're YKK? Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because we invented it. Is that a Swedish thing? No, I'm kidding. Uh, I'm making a joke. But you're right. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. So, okay, let's talk to our boy, Hunger. Let's check Wait, in. Wait, Zipper was invented by an American inventor in Chicago. <laughs> That's fucking lies, Hold dude. on, love that just... Is, <laughs> that just is looked it a up. fucking lie. 1892, is Whitcomb L. Judson. Why is it lie? Is it maybe that he is of Swedish descent? That's still America. Whoa. We get that one. Um, that is Danish propaganda. That is Danish propaganda. That is Danish propaganda. <laughs> Those motherfuckers lying. Whatever did you you're learn, reading there. Wait, hold wrong. on, hold on. Where did you learn that? Is, did they teach kids that in school? Uh, yeah. And <laughs> the zipper. <laughs> Everybody knows the zi- oh, the Swedes invented the zipper. We love the well, zipper here just, in Sweden. Everyone in here, Google it. Google. I believe. I did. Love. That's I how I found love. out this. An- I didn't know. <laughs> We're Americans. You, we take what we want. Gro- yeah, you're Googling from America. Programs. They're blocking your search results. This is Whitcomb L. Hudson erased. Okay, here, I've got it. I've got it. Who invented the zipper? He was Swedish-American. There you go. Called okay. Gideon Sundback. Oh, see, and he's, I have he, zipper information Swedish. here. He's generally credited with inventing the modern zipper as we know it. He first registered his patent for the device in Germany, but it wasn't until 1917 that he received a patent for a device called a separable fastener. Yo, this mm-hmm. man patented the zipper? What a fucking king. <laughs> yeah. Big W. So are you getting a different name? Because I'm seeing Gideon Sundback. I, I'm, get, I'm getting, uh, I'm on the Wikipedia page for zipper, for zippers, and right at the very beginning, in 1892, Whitcomb L. Judson, an American Whoa. inventor from Chicago, patented, patented, Patented we have t- the original design from which the modern device evolved. This we have two very different. Uh, yeah, I don't know we're getting such different answers. Here. I'm oh. getting my information from Sweden.se, so that <laughs> <laughs> that can't be. That's not <laughs> biased. biased. At all. That's not biased at all. Sweden.gov. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I see. Oh, well. Wait, hold on. Let me look oh. up the guy. Here's the guy. People are saying Get, this is American propaganda. Uh, maybe. I okay, just, well, I just, I just Googled it. Hold on. Here's the guy. Gideon Sun, Sundbuck. Sundbuck. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He was born in... Uh, he was born uh, in Sweden. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He died in America. Yeah. So wh- yep. who gets him? Well, I mean... Wait, it mentions Hudson. Hold on. He built upon the previous work of other engineers, such as we Elias, talk with How Max we Wolf, move on. and Whitcomb L. <laughs> Judson. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo. Wait, where did you read that? Why you... Hunger FF is on the line. Hold on, hold on, love. Down this in is the important. career section, second paragraph. Okay. Your second paragraph. Way past. <laughs> oh, second paragraph. Yeah. Second career. paragraph of the In 1905, Gideon Sundback started okay. at, to work right. in the Westinghouse Electric and Manufacturing Company in Pittsburgh. So this all happened in America. This is American ingenuity, baby. Fuck yeah. You think <laughs> you think a zipper could have been invented in Sweden? Yeah. I mean, what the fuck is jam? <laughs> 245 years of slinging dick, baby. Mm. In America. Mm. There's a reason you're moving here. Come on, love. No, American supremacy, true. baby. I'll, I'll come to America and I'll invent something. From the zipper all the way to the atomic bomb, baby. <laughs> It's all America. 1906, mm-hmm. Sunback was hired to work for the Universal Fastener Company of Hoboken, New Jersey. Subsequently, in 1909, Sunback was promoted to the position. Okay, wait. Sunback made several advances in the development of the zipper between 1906 and 1914. Existed. I'm sure he, he, probably, he probably improved it and made it much better, but he didn't invent it. Right. And how could a Swede? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I mean, what have they, what they invented? But, invented you know, a bunch of shit. But to be honest, I would have to see what the original one looked like because here it says known for invention of the zipper. Right. So what we're was getting. That name? What was Judson's name? Whit- Whitcomb L. Judson. What a name. 
<laughs> what come L. Judson? Here's this idiot. Yeah. It's not and then bad. he also known for invention of the zipper. That's what I'm saying. So I guess this was a collaborative effort. Yeah, so here's, uh, here's this was the ma This was the Manhattan Project of 1909. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> Here, look. Oh, that's a mess, bro. What is yeah, that? What, yeah, what the heck is that, dude? It's an early zipper. No, I think the Swede you guy. You see the design. Now look, it, it, it's the exact same thing. There's a metal piece here, and it pulls it together, and it and it combines it. It's a zipper. It is brilliant invention that we take for granted. Yeah, zippers but, are awesome. Yeah. We can right. share in the glory. I don't want to make this a, a national. Well, hold thing, on. So this know? is the original one. Now let me see the new guys, the Swedish guys. Uh, what was his name? Right. Uh, fuck. Let me go back. Gideon <laughs> Sund. Gideon Sundback. Gideon Sundback. Here, oh here it is. I got a picture here. So this guy took it to the next level. Here's his shit. That doesn't. See that? That's, that's still a modern look like a modern zipper. It does. What do you mean? Yeah. How are you crazy? You, okay, oh, I guess we're it? seeing the back of it, aren't we? I'm just because yeah. it doesn't have the little tab. Our boy Gideon, he took it all the way to the zipper. Right. So he improved it. I think that's fair. Yeah. It's a collaborative effort. He, you yeah. know, humanity has always well, advanced. When we look beyond borders and lines in the sand, and we That's come together true. as people, you know what? Uh, I'll take that handshake. Yeah, handshake. Well, it's it's as it's as Sir Isaac Newton I said. Uh, I only see so far because I stand on the back of giants of the giants before me. Yeah, that's that's true. And uh, of course, Gideon was talking about the great, uh, the very great uh, other <laughs> whatever dude, his name is, the other guy. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that guy. <laughs> All right, let's talk. Speaking of zippers, let's talk to Hunger. Let's zip something open. <laughs> Let me see that ass meat, brother. Okay, hold on. All hey, right, you I'm guys letting, remember? I'm him into the Zoom. One second. Hunger FF is here. Uh, if you guys remember him, he called in first time when Howie Mandel was on the show, and he did a live prolapse demonstration for Howie. Fantastic moment. I'm sorry, I don't mean to always be testing the... the no, boundaries. I'm kidding, it's not your fault, you're all good. So how have you been? I've been really, really great, how about you guys? How the, has business been, been good since our last appearance on the show? It's been really insanely, uh, overwhelmingly awesome. Like, yeah. the amount of red sub-threads and stuff about me since I was on your show is, um, it's a little crazy. So, oh, that, well, positive, I hope. Oh yeah, you guys, good. it was, you know what's funny is I had a friend of mine that was like, Warren, he's like, there, you know, it's, it can, they can, it can be a little crazy on that show sometimes. And I'm like, okay, like I braced myself for like negative kind of like back, you know, feedback, but it was, it's been nothing but positive. That's, so you guys, I think, thank you. I think we can be crazy, but we try to be crazy nice for the most part, right? Crazy nice. Yeah. So, um, um yeah. obviously, would you say that some of our fans are, got converted into the prolapse life? Do you think there's some people from our audience that are now consuming your content? I mean, there's definitely a new group of people that are following me on Twitter that I, you know, new people that definitely came from, from your Somewhere. show. Somewhere. Uh, okay, cool. Wow. Fooper Troopers out there. It's awesome. It's awesome. Well, I would it's say... Every thing. Oh, sorry, go but, ahead, Hunger. Your fan base is rabid. So. Yeah, they're, they are. And they're, they're <laughs> the best. They really are amazing. But I think everyone was taken by just how sweet and gentle and authentic you were. So I think it was uh, due to your your genuineness. So we're here today to announce this really remarkable um, achievement. This has got to be the first ever prolapse dildo. Is that right? It's it's definitely the first prolapse dildo uh, I've ever seen. Um, it's totally one of a kind and different um, than anything else on the market right now. And so I'm hoping that it makes it made a big enough splash that it's crashed my website today. Oh, so, my God. Do you yeah. know how many? So are you selling a lot of them right now or do you have a finite? Is it sold out? I promised myself I wasn't going to take a look at the sales until the end of the day, but the fact that this is bigger than like the first day I launched the website is, it, I, I didn't crash the site on the first day, it's crashed the site now, so it's pretty wild. Wow. <laughs> so I gotta, I gotta ask you about the logistics of this thing. When I first saw it, I thought it would be like a fleshlight. You put yeah, your dick well, in the prolapse, but what I found is that it's just a giant fucking dildo. And, and the original plan was for it to be a fleshlight and um and a dildo at the same time. I kind of wanted it something like oh. fuck it and 
whatever. But um, that is going to end up being like a version 2.0 at some point down the line. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah. So because I find, coming. I don't know that there's a, a lot of uh, people who can make use of such a great sized uh, dildo. Well, we're doing it in four sizes. So yeah. there's, it's been scaled down. So like, this... um, there's a, a small, medium, large, and an extra large. So there's, uh, the XL is the closest to my actual Right, anatomy. for the authentic. And so is the idea, because the tip of it is is quite thick. Like, there's no easing in of this toy. So is the intended sure. use of this thing just to lube up and go in? Like, it, you just, it's just, it is what it is? How do you recommend think... people to use it, you know? So Hanky's Toys, the company that I, I partnered with to do the, the toy, uh, they are kind of known for more um, extreme or like kind of like out there toys. They do like realistic sci-fi, all kinds of things for all different skill levels. And so we did skill um, level, meaning you know, um, how much you can fit in your book. Right. Pro, <laughs> right. Pro <laughs> pro level being the you can fit the most. Yeah, you're, it's you're, pretty wild. I mean, like the the toys yeah. that they make are you know pretty crazy. But um, the idea is basically just to kind of create something that I get asked so frequently by guys that I film with or play with, like, "Can you fuck me with it?" And I'm like, "No, it's like fucking logistically impossible." So, <laughs> so I figured, you know, if we did something together, that I would uh, want to kind of cater to that type of kind of ah. Uh, so there was a need. A lot of your co star says, "I want you to put your prolapse in me." But it's too yeah. soft. You can't do it, right? It's just like, I mean, imagine trying to kind of like fit two people together that way. It's like, it's kind of logistically impossible. Right. So, um, yeah, it's, uh, I've tried it, you know, we've tried it, but I mean, it's, it's a little bit kind of difficult. So, so there's yeah. probably a lot of high, high skill level people out there probably looking forward to inserting that in their, uh, buttholes, eh? <laughs> Well, when I got it, I got the box of them, the, the ones that I got, I received uh, to, to sell myself. And I'm like, oh, look, it, it's a box of buttholes. Like, mm -hmm. it's like, it's like, it just, like, it gets crazy. So um, there's a lot of people out there, I think, that, um, you know, at least niche people that are going to be really excited and eager to, to, to play with it. So. This is exciting. I got to tell you, that thing's well made, man. That is like, if you talk about ass meat, boy, that's like 10 pounds of ass meat. And it is thick. I was slapping it, and it was like, boom. I watched, um, did you see the, uh, did you notice the hair around the base? Yeah, of course. How could it's I miss that? It's sort of insane. So, yeah, I don't know if, um, it's wild. They did an amazing job with it, so. So I know traditionally, um, when you make a sex toy like that, a man, uh, let's just talk dildo, because that's the most uh, mainstream, will put his dick in a kind of type of molding situation, silicon molding situation, and then they fill it with silicon and they get a perfect mold of, of the dick. Now, I'm a, sure. now the prolapse, the technique of doing that's gotta be a little bit different. Were you able to dip your prolapse into a mold? How did that work? Um, so there was, I, I would like to leave a little bit of it to the imagination as for how we got it to be as accurate as it was, but um, we definitely, <laughs> I'll just say that there is somebody out there that's very familiar with every detail of my insides, more familiar than I am now at this point. So um, we didn't necessarily do a, um, a, a real traditional mold or casting, but it's um, it's a it's a similar price. I, I don't want to get too specific as to how we did it, but it's 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 as accurate of a replica that I can go that we that we could have possibly made. Oh, what? Because you the... can realistically stick like I like me like doing that into like a like a like a mold would have been you know it was a lot of hoops to jump through to make it happen so and so um well what are you are you guys protecting some proprietary secret here or what's going on what's the mystery I just kind of want to we kind of want to leave it a little bit to the imagination as to how we made it happen like the um the, the actual process of um I'll say it was it was sculpted okay is that a, a so did so, you did you prolapse uh, in front of an artist or some somehow like that kind of like yeah something like that something along those lines yeah it was like um it was basically kind of like we had a we had a um yeah there was an artist that was kind of involved that kind of just sculpted it based on you know so can you da uh, can oh, you dangle the prolapse out for that long oh yeah oh my goodness yeah whoa okay wild. wow. 
<laughs> so you kind of were just pro whole meat out for a for a fair bit of time. What's the longest you've had your meat out at one time before? Does it dry uh, out? It. So as I always always say that it's like as long as it stays um, wet and warm, the sun's kind of gross. But I mean, like it's uh, wet and warm. then it's fine. Yeah, okay. it can be out for as, as long as it wants or as long as I want. But um, so it's like it's, a uh, it's like a whale in a sense. You got to just keep it. You keep putting water on it and keep you know keep it comfortable moisture. and happy. Yeah, it's my ass whale. Oh my god! Yeah, <laughs> no, yeah, it's, it's uh, your ass orca. It's, uh, yeah, we're gonna change the name from ass meat to ass whale, ass orca. So, what's but, the um, technique you know, of keeping the your ass orca uh, happy and uh, you know out? Um, like I, I mean, just you know, I always tell people, I have guys that will come over and do straight up sessions with me where they just want to play with that, and yeah. so I'm like, uh, as long as there's enough lube on it and it stays, we turn the AC down, like or off. Okay. Um, then it's usually okay. So just lots of lube and like maybe the the playing and the friction probably helps keep it warm as well. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah. It's sort of weird when I talk about it like this because in in the context of like play, it's all really hot and fun and like crazy. But then when you sit back in a non-play situation and start talking about it, it's like it's very kind of like what is it's a it's such a wild kind of crazy. Well, thing. I think it's important that we stop and pause and analyze, you know, what we're doing in life. I don't find it gross. I find it fascinating. I mean, you are one of you're you're a uh, rare kind of specialized person in this world and uh we all applaud your ass orca <laughs> we appreciate the artistry I gotta, another, I gotta get another one of these shirts made that says ass orca on it now. <laughs> yeah dude love that like a beached whale yeah no <laughs> well that's so that's so, so can you guys check his website i can't say the url i'm sorry but check i want to see if it's sold out well, it's down. It might. I think my web guy's working on it. As oh, it's as, still as, down. As, we're we're still working on getting it up, but it's um, it crashed like maybe like a half hour ago. Oh no! The amount of traffic, the amount of traffic that was in the site is is ridiculous right now. So, oh man! Can I ask you what's the what's the MSRP on those things? Because it looks real expensive. They range. It ranges from about one hundred and fifty to like two fifty, um, depending I, on the size that you get. Yeah, I'm, I'm not surprised. That is a thick piece of fucking meat, dude. You know, put and it's metal. Yeah, it's it's platinum cured silicone, so it's like the highest kind of quality toy right. that you can actually right make. And so, if um, it's not like a lot of the old school toys that would make with materials that would break down over time, this is going to last forever, basically. Yeah, we tried to visit it. We we got a we got a timeout. The people yeah, are working on this. the people are hungry, and the, all yeah. they want is ass meat. It's crazy. <laughs> would so you, you, guys, uh, you know what would be would interesting? interesting? Oh, what's that? To get fucked by your own prolapse could possibly be an interesting uh, concept for you. Yeah, that's that's uh, go fuck yourself to a new meaning or to a new level. But we're definitely going to I'm going to be doing something like that at some point in the future. Uh, I was thinking about doing like a reverse <laughs> like base first. Oh, my God. Hunger. <laughs> I that, mean, like, that what? Is, you know what? <laughs> you, you know what? That is pro level, my friend. That is the hot. <laughs> Because the base is just a fucking <laughs> He's brick. the best at what he does. Yeah, you're the best. You're a pro. You're a pro. So, you, so that's yeah, have you have you fucked your own prolapse yet, or is that uh, to be to be uh, continued? I just got them. Um, like the, I, I just got them like yesterday. Um, so I haven't had a chance to to try it out myself yet. Okay, but that's exciting. It's gonna... Does it turn? I mean, like, there's not really many people out there that can. I mean. I think I'm the only person that can say they got fucked by their own asshole then at this point. Absolutely. So. I mean, that's a huge, come on. One of a kind. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> and, um, would you, could you get turned on by your own ass me in a sense if you, because I know you're, you're a connoisseur of this style that you participate in. And I'm trying to think like, could you get turned on by your own ass meat or is it uh, not doesn't work when it's yourself, you know? Uh, I'll tell you, it's very difficult for me to find like porn to get off to because I'll like look for that type of porn and it's just me. Ah, <laughs> like, right. I'll, like, I'll Google, I'll look on like, you know, whatever site and I'm just like, okay, this the three pages of me are there's something else out wow. there. Wow. So, yeah, there's, 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 you know, this, it's definitely kind of something that's growing in popularity that I've been able to find some other guys that are doing similar stuff, but I'm not saying I was turned on by my own. That's kind of like, 
I'm, I don't think that's really necessarily accurate, but um, I do make the kind of porn that turns me on. So, um, you know what I mean? It's like, it's like, it's the kind of porn that I would want to watch. So uh, I guess in that sense, it is stuff that turns me on. It's yeah, you well, there, I guess if there's just not enough out there, you probably just end up consuming your own content, you know? I guess maybe. Yeah, it's uh, it's real. It's, it's tricky to find stuff that gets you know. Because and then the other thing is, I know most of these guys. Right. These are your like, friends. I know it's it's kind of weird to beat off to my friends. So. Right. Brothers and prolapse. Basically, yeah. How so. many? Of you, what if you go to like one of these popular? Porn websites. How many views is is do your kind of videos get like on the Mac side? Uh, I think my one most popular on uh, Pornhub has like five or six million. Yo, let's wild. go. What's the percentage it, of what's the like ratio? Do you know? Um, it's pretty divided because it's, a, it's people, divisive, I mean, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I, I was gonna do like a like a hunger ff reads mean comments kind of video one day. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> so, because you know, the the comments are like they range from like, oh my god, this is the greatest thing ever, to oh my god, I need to like bleach my eyeballs. Right. So, it's I mean, your uh, the comments on the the video you guys posted were pretty awesome too. Uh, which ones? Like, I don't uh, remember. On Twitter. <laughs> oh yeah, well that is. <laughs> that people to my page and then they went to the uh the pinned video and they went a little crazy <laughs> oh right 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 we did show a lot ab do you have any questions for hunger uh no <laughs> uh -huh. i've re rendered him speechless so. <laughs> yeah <laughs> now i just land the like ratio i'm seeing 90 to 100 percent. a lot of people they dig it okay that's, that's so sweet. nice that's so Very nice. nice yeah people are saying so, they can't rewind i don't know what that is dan I, I know what it is. We don't want people to be able to rewind. Oh, you can turn that off. Yeah, yeah, baby. Ow, oh. ow. Oh. So, um, well, I got a question for you because you're at the top of the game. You kind of own this whole genre. How are you doing financially? Are you set for life at this point? Um, I'm trying to. Uh, I'm always kind of like on a grind. Like I'm always trying to kind of, of like see, you know, it's like, I'm trying to think of like, most people can't take this type of thing, turn like a career into it. It's like something that has like a shelf life, but I've been doing this now for like 16 years. Wow. Kind of, it's all I've known for most of my, you know, my entire adult life. So, um, I'm setting, you know, I've got retirement and stocks and stuff like that, that I'm, I'm investing. In. So I know this could all end tomorrow. You know what right. I mean? Like it could, so I'm trying to keep it so that I'm setting myself up for the future Good at for some you. point. But eventually the plan is to go behind the camera and not be so involved anymore in events and stuff like that. But this was the next phase kind of for me. How many how many uh, good years do you think you have left? I mean, I don't in, ter know. in terms of prolapsing, you know, in front of the camera. Um, I mean, like, as, as long as people aren't sick of me, I'm going to keep doing it. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, as long as, uh, you know, people are still kind of watching. I mean, I, I love doing this stuff. It's the, the creative aspect of it is really great for me, like being able to edit and stuff like that. That's like my creative outlet. And um, it's, it's, it's fun for me. That part's fun. I, I'm getting reports that your highest viewed video is 9.4 million on P-Hub. Oh, my God. Oh, That's combined, crazy. combined. Okay, combined. That's a yeah. lot. So I know that, Model yeah, rank 78. You're actually on the leaderboard. That's crazy. Well, and, and before, like, do you remember, did you know about the Pornhub kind of, like, cleanse when they had, like, the, uh, yes. they, they, yeah, so I was, um, before then, I had, like, a, um, I was updating Pornhub really regularly with, like, like longer videos, and um, then after the purge, I was sort of kind of just do trailers and stuff now, so before that, it was, it was a little bit higher, but. Wait, why did you stop posting? Because I thought the purge was just that they removed unverified videos. They removed unverified videos, but then also they, sorry, I got to fix the camera. Um, Go they removed unverified videos, but then they um, uh, stopped allowing you to post videos for paid uh, paid content. Oh. Yeah. So they like they took away their model program. So when the model program left, I, I left with it because oh. I was like, oh. So wait, they used yeah. to pay people to post and then they stopped? Yeah. yeah. So the same week that what? I got kicked off of all. Yeah. 
They used to we used to be able to sell videos on Pornhub, and they we can't do it anymore. It's it's pretty it's do pretty you know, wild. Do you know why they stopped doing that? It was the um, the revenge porn lawsuit. Uh, those the girls, the women that kind of came together and said that they were being like, you know, that Pornhub wasn't removing their content, and then Visa and Mastercard pulled their contract. Oh, and so they couldn't, they can't process payments anymore. <laughs> so without being able to process payments, the models can't sell videos. So oh, that no. might take an old. That's such a shame because I mean, if you're verifying your ID, it's a shame that all these other models uh, are suffering. Yeah. I was one of the only people that survived the purge, but at that point it was like, they can't buy my videos, so why am Did why you have a I... huge drop in revenue when that happened? The same week I got kicked off of OnlyFans was the same day that Pornhub got, um, Ooh. like, there. Was that yeah, so I, lost, I I crawled into a ball and, and cried, and then I decided to start, start my own website. <laughs> oh my goodness. Why, why would, was, so, wait, OnlyFans doesn't allow you either? OnlyFans won't allow me either. They're, you know, it's, it's interesting about OnlyFans is that they're incorporated in the United Kingdom, mm -hmm. uh, which has some of the most strictest obscenity laws on the planet. Mm. Uh, so anything kink, fetish, um, anything outside of like kind of traditional vanilla sex is not allowed on OnlyFans. That's so silly. They're like only sex that we think is cool. Yeah, it's really fuck crazy. The I think. I don't fuck the king. Fuck the king. Fuck the king. King Charles could never. Yeah, it was it was a pretty 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 rough week when that happened, but um, I turned it into something positive. It's like I decided I was like, okay, I'm going to take what I've saved and build my own proprietary site and go from there and see what happens. And I rolled the dice, and here I am on your show. <laughs> you know? Good for you. Good for you. Um, well, hunger. We're all so happy for your success. You know, thanks for calling in. It's always a joy. And I mean, you prolapsing for Howie Mandel for us is definitely a highlight for me. Oh, for like forever, I, I you know. I can't get over the look on your face when I did it with him because look, you looked like a kid in a candy store. Oh when man, I fucking did it. that <laughs> it's amazing. That was like a full crescendo of planning and and uh, maestroing to get Howie in the office, and then you dropping trow. I mean, it was just a it was a magical moment for me. So thank you for giving me that. I, uh, my 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 literal pleasure. So, like, yeah, it's all good. yeah. Thank all you right, for well, having me back. Absolutely. Stay lubed out there, okay? Just keep it lubed, keep it warm. Thanks, guys. And it was, um, yeah, it was wet. great to be back. Yeah, keep it wet, keep it lubed, keep it warm. All right. <laughs> care, Hunger, when you, when you are masturbating, do you put stuff in your butt, or are you cool just to hit the, the dick? <laughs> I mean, like, I... <laughs> this is just by yourself. I'm just curious if you, if you need to go that route, or if you, you know what I mean? I don't get off usually with any without anything on my ass. Okay, I see. Much, I see. That's the whole. Thing. My, brain, my brain is rewired to kind of think with my head. So, right. Okay. And so, when you're getting off by yourself, what kind of stuff do you find yourself putting up there? What my stuff? Uh, a hanky toy dildo. Honestly, generally, like my entire toy collection is is all the company that I ended up working with. So um, I've been, you know, a huge fan of them forever, and so I've oh. got pretty much. All of the stuff that they've they've made. So do you? This is gonna sound crazy. Go ahead. No, go oh, ahead. Go ahead. No, you go ahead. This is a, this is a, um, uh, I also have like a custom. This is uh, you know, like guys that use dick pumps. Mm -hmm. I've got a pump. Prolapse for my pump. <laughs> oh, a prolapse pump. So, yeah. Okay, that's fun. It's pretty wild. So, um, and the I I the idea of the prolapse pump uh, pump is to make it more swollen, more more large. Pretty much. Yeah, it's, it's pretty extreme and like, you know, it's it's it is, you know, but my entire sex life is a little extreme. So sure. like, yeah. And so when you were, uh, so we're talking, they make these. So what kind of dildo are we using? Uh, uh, is it like just a giant penis or is it like a monster tentacle? Uh, it's just I mean, like it's they're just giant dicks. So oh, okay, but it's funny, okay. guys, will come, I'll have guys come over to play whatever you know, film and they're like, do you have to do you have toys? Do you have toys? I'm like. I have toys for me, so like right. I bring them out and they're just like, um, what am I gonna do? <laughs> right, right, right. Show me how thick we're talking. I'm just curious. Is it like a real dick or like a? Uh, <laughs> just show me in thickness with your hands. Holy shit, brother! So it's not like a life. <laughs> it's not a life size dick. It's like a. Yeah, nobody has there, a dick that big. 
They're titled, I mean, like the Goliath or the Ogre or something like that. <laughs> right, like, right, like, right. Really, really, the Orca. The boss hawk. Yeah, the Orca. <laughs> You're the man, dude. So I love that. Uh, intense. You're the man. Thanks, Thanks, Hunger. You take care, okay? We're we're rooting for you. We love you. Love you guys too. Thanks you're sweet. For you're a sweet man. God bless you. Keep it up. Easy. Have a good one. Thanks for letting me come on. Bye, Hunger. Good man. Bye later, guys. You're a good man. You gotta respect someone who's just who thought you could unapologetically you know, himself. That's mm-hmm. it. No, mm-hmm. good at his craft. Yep. He's pro level. Such a nice guy. He knows what he's here on this earth. He's to do. master level. Yeah. Pro doesn't describe. Yeah. yeah. This man doesn't get off unless it's this thick. Man is a pro with the lap. the Goliath, bro. Yeah. Michael Jordan of pro laps is right there. <laughs> yeah. The goat. I think he's he's such a sweet guy though. In mm-hmm. all honesty, we love that for him. You know. Um. Not every day you meet a legend, you know. There's a few times in my life where I feel like I was looking at a legend. First time was when I saw Celine Dion live, and mm-hmm. this may be the second. Celine Dion and Hunger. Mm-hmm. They both have a lot in common yeah. in terms of talent. They do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. A.B., you seem to be, uh, I looked over at you. Uh, Running around the and office, I, And I just, I noticed that. It was, yeah. Sorry, we're just, uh, so anyway, but thank you to Hunger. I mean, he's the man. The Goliath, bro. Mm-hmm. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep, yep. God damn it. Hold the fucking phone. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh. Uh, Kim Kardashian. 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 All right, I'm going to let the kids out. What does that mean? <laughs> Take a shit? You're opening chat back up. Uh, oh. Kim Kardashian. Playground. Um, hold on, hold on. Can you, can, can you, can you just mute the mics? Play, give them an air message. I need to ask Here, why not? I'm going to hold the button. Hold the button? Yeah. You're just going to race this whole part? No. All this. Here, let's wait a second so that people understand. Here, I'm waiting 20 seconds right now so you all understand why it's about to cut away. Wait, you, I, when can I talk? Not yet. Not yet. Feel free to submit new stuff on the subreddit for the cards. We update okay. it every week. Go ahead. So they can't see this? No. So, so <laughs> you cropped it out, Ian? Yeah. And how yeah, long was it on a, screen? It, like it was like a minute minutes, or two. Probably. And yeah. how did you crop it out? And then he adjusted his in. camera at one point, yeah, and at one point put it back in front. Bro, what the fuck? Hunger is a monster. Zach told him. Dude, if he comes, if he comes on again, we gotta screen his frame. That's yeah. fucked up. Hunger's killing me, dude. All right, are you ready to come back? Well, I don't know what to do about that. That's pretty bad. Well, we can blur. I can, it. I can set the episode to auto unlist when we, as soon as we go off the air, and then we'll crop it out and just post it later once it's cut out. I mean, what else can we do? But see, that doesn't really eliminate our liability. I mean, what else can we do? Is it that? It's smaller than what you think. It's not that big. Let's just when the there. let's just when the episode's done, crop it out, the whole dildo part and the cock part, and just hope for the best. Okay. Because I don't think unlisting is going to matter if people report it and YouTube sees it. So, what's the order of operations here? I think just when we're done, just crop it out and not fucking pray. Okay. Delete the whole episode for that? No, just his inter- Just his interview. Well, we can settle that after we go off the air, but... We- we fun. gotta act like we didn't talk about anything when you yeah. impressed the button. No, but we should decide because it is pretty important. I- I think you should just cut the interview and then re-upload it as a highlight when it's censored. Cut the whole interview out. Yeah, and then upload it as a highlight. Well, no, you can cut just cut the dick and the dildo part. Yeah, but it's like the whole beginning of the interview. But thing. you can blur stuff too when you cut. There's like a blur option. You could blur it. Oh, I wonder if the blur's faster. What? Yeah. 
No, if it's well, if it's cut, well, it doesn't matter either way. Yeah, it doesn't matter either way. It doesn't. So if even, the damage is done. Yeah, the damage from is done. YouTube's perspective. Then yeah. the best thing we can do is just hope nobody reports it and cut out. And so let's just cut. It's... Let's just no. Let's just cut the dildo and the picture. You want to cut the whole thing, the whole interview? Well, it, again, that's the whole beginning of the interview. Well, who cares? It'll just be a little weird. Just be a little awkward. I mean, we could cut the whole thing. You think just cut the whole thing? I feel bad cutting it. He did fuck us, though. He knew what he was doing, dude. Yeah, no. It, he knew what he was doing. You you think he did that intentionally? I don't know. Yeah. I think so. Zach told him directly. So, yeah. Kind Why of, would he do that? I think so, too. He had, I don't think he had so. explicit instructions of what to do, and he didn't do it. So, I, I don't know what to say. Either he's... Com- he's a lot... Yeah, I mean, we've okay. Been so on let's this do the show. Like let's let's do the show. Let's just cut out the obscene, obscene part. I'm in favor of keeping the interview. If it, if it's awkward, it's fine. Okay. It just look a little glitchy. All right, let's come back. All right, releasing right now. Hey guys, we just had a little bit of a technical issue. Thank you everybody for uh, standing by and standing back. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed those button screens. If you'd like to see, yeah, you some. got to see the yeah. whole loop this yeah. time. Did they see the whole loop? I don't Probably. think it was. No, I don't. I think it's like a fifteen-minute video or something. But it's if you long at this point, but... I'm always at a new one. So if you'd like to submit your own, feel free to on our subreddit. We have our own button flare. Have a chance to mm-hmm. have your work seen on the show. Yeah. <clears throat> all right, let's see here. We well, we got all kinds of fun stuff. Uh, always nice to hear from Hunger, though. Do you think he's a millionaire? I was wondering that. Do you think he's worth seven digits? He could no, probably... I really don't know. I don't know. I mean, I guess there he's... is a lot of money in like the ver- like the hyper specific like kink stuff. And like he's that, the so. he's like yeah, the based goat. on ability, absolutely hundred percent. Right. I think he deserves it. Right. He's the goat. Mm-hmm. Um. Well, good for him, man. He could probably fit a million ones in his butthole. Yeah. Just saying. <laughs> 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 All right, let's see. We got some other fun stuff. Like the quartering is going to be in a boxing match this year. Let's go. Okay, Keemstar. He's out. Keemstar is going to work with like the dumbest, weirdest, stupidest. Oh my god! Like throwaway. I mean, he brought us Boogie versus Swings though, and uh, Zach loved that. Right? No. I'm not gonna say a word, man. What? What happened? You didn't get toasted for that. I found it entertaining. Quality boxing match. You weren't the only one. We watched it on the show. Yeah, quality. Now review Tech USA versus Quartering. Now this is this is gonna be the matchup the uh, that everybody's waiting for here, boy. Hell yeah! Super exciting times. Yep. Yeah, next year they're gonna have t- Ryan Toys reviews ver- versus the uh, oh the guy who dissects gummy bears. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Ryan Toys reviews is growing up. I'll tell you, man. Don't underestimate him. Uh-oh. He's getting bigger. Mm-hmm. Very exciting. Has um, Quarterin commented on this yet? Uh, let me see. I'm stoked. I think Quarterin's gonna take the dub here. Look, I'm 40. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm sweaty. I'm fat. I'm overweight. No fucking way, bro. No, 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 no. <laughs> Keemstar says, would I get canceled if I put ED, EDP445 four, in a boxing match against Donut Operator? Yes. Do not. You fucking psycho. Jesus. <laughs> EDP445, four, four, of course, is the guy who... Cupcake? He... He's the cupcake guy. I mean, the he cupcake? got absolutely <laughs> annihilated for going to meet. I don't remember how old she was, like 14 or something. It's like 13, 13 or 14, yeah. 13, my God. What a nightmare that would be. Fuck. Yeah, please don't do that. But, like, you give a fuck. Yeah, I can't wait to give this pedophile a big payday. <laughs> Says Keemstar. <laughs> I can't wait to make a bunch of money off this pedophile. So, uh, congratulations uh, to Quartering. Very much looking forward to that one there. Uh, Crowder. 
has a new meltdown on Twitter. This guy, I can't even believe he's talking about anything, bro, after what happened. Like, bro, <laughs> dude, that doesn't work I for me either. No, that doesn't work either. Steven to YouTube. That doesn't work either. That doesn't work either. This fucking idiot loser who, by the way, already left YouTube, is Watch crying. He didn't leave. Watch he it. said he was going to leave. Or, well, you know. He hasn't left. So, uh, he had Alex Jones host a show, it looks like. Or, wait, a bunch of them. Inside footage, Alex Jones. Alex Jones host. Well, if you're having Alex Jones host your show, who's been banned, <laughs> it stands to assume that it's probably going to get removed. And I don't even know what was in the content. I'm sure it was some psychotic, <sighs> transphobic, homophobic uh, Alex conspiracy Jones theory. Yeah. yeah, I actually have the clip of it. I was saving it for leftovers, but since we're talking about this, I might as well show you. Watch it. Oh, the so one that we got in trouble. Band? Yeah, I guess um, we we got taken off the air once for showing Alex Jones content, if you recall. But they reversed ago. it. <laughs> yeah, but remember, it was the only time that's ever happened. They actually cut our live stream. It wasn't just that the content. Right. We straight up got bumped. And then off Joe the Rogan air. DM'd me. You remember that? That did prompt that, didn't it? Yeah. Joe Rogan's like, "What happened, dude?" <laughs> This is ridiculous. He got all up in arms about it. Yeah. Suck at a ding dong. I was like, hi. Um, but yeah, I don't know if we could show it because it was... Uh, what does he say in it? He is pretending to be Asian and pulling his uh, <laughs> eyes back and doing... Buck My man! And, <laughs> I was right. It was uh, super racist. It was unbelievably racist. While they were in the middle of a discussion about, like... Um, Asians being targeted for uh, hate crimes, by the way, <laughs> and then awesome. all of a sudden he just decided, just kind of out of the blue, he's like, uh, I identify as Asian, and then started doing a really horrible, <laughs> stereotypical Chinese, uh, just probably, but I guess better not to watch it. I, yeah, I feel like we, <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know. As much as I would like to watch it. Oh yeah, screen cap's a good idea. Yeah, we could do that, right? Ditch. I mean, we're, t we're just talking about the news here. Bitch titch. As the host, guest host of Louder with Crowder, Alex Jones has reported saying he identifies as Asian. Here is, oh my god. Dude, what is wrong with you, bro? You somehow... Again, You just look like a demon, about, brother. While talking about uh, anti-Asian discrimination. Decided to... Uh, I guess that launch into this bit. I get. I guess in the conservative spheres, this one still kills. That's crazy. Straight from the playground. It kills. It kills Crowder's YouTube channel. Hopefully. He yeah. Is so deterring. Just like the Bile. image of him. I just can't look anymore. Oh, they're trying to roast him because he went. This dude surf TV went on Tim Pool, destroyed them, and he said hooking up with a trans woman isn't gay. She's a woman. And so now they're trying to- Sucking dick ain't gay. Well, brother, I got bad news for you. All your homies are gay. Amazing. All your idols Amazing. are gay. <laughs> Amazing. You are gay? Hmm. There it is. There it is. So he said, fuck you, YouTube. I don't get- I don't give a shit that we're one strike away from being banned. Permanently from the platform. We will not pacify. We will not kowtow. And we will not stop. Except for the two weeks where we're not allowed to post. No, that doesn't work either. Not <laughs> now. Not ever. We say when it's over. Hashtag mug club says when it's over. Not some patsy in Silicon Valley. And then meanwhile at home, how, what's he sound like? No, that doesn't work either. Not that tough sounding. Don't miss tomorrow's episode. This means war. The stakes have never been higher. Who's fucking reading this shit and getting it all the time? Here's another tweet from just a few months ago. Tomorrow is war. Last time that he went to war with YouTube. Sleep well. He just wanted us to do more sketches. I think that's it. Dressed up as like uh, a warrior or something. More cosplays. I can't wait. He is also declaring war another time last year. He also said he was suing them, which was a lie. Right, this lawsuit. The Did he crowdfund on war. suing them? That never happened? I don't think he crowd. Well, not Mug beyond it. promoting Mug Club. Mug Club it. Like he always does, so. 
Why is he not permanently banned? I mean, please, let's just, uh, you know. It's the biggest evidence against his whole thesis that, like, conservatives are fucking squelched on YouTube. I get like, banned bro. as much as him. Yeah. Or from, yeah. But like, what the fuck? I don't know. They got this crazy victim complex. Just stop being a baby, dude. You know the fucking rules. They're going to enforce the rules. That's what it is. Stop it. You know? Or don't. Or don't. We will not, well, he says he's not going to. We will not stop, except for the two weeks when we're not allowed to upload. <laughs> we will never surrender, except for when we get a strike and, and YouTube says don't post. It doesn't work either. This is how he sees himself, eh? Uh, the, the Spartans were very homosexual, uh, right? I mean, they fuck, and also they fuck kids, I think, too. Didn't they? That's what you, uh... Yeah, all the Greeks did. You said to him, uh, during the Sam Cedar incident. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I can see why he, you know, identifies. I don't know that he fucks kids. Right. Uh, how would I know that? I hope he doesn't. Fucking watch it. Oh, yeah, no, I hope he doesn't, sure. Watch it. Uh, but, uh, there it is. Steven Crowder. Getting fired up. <laughs> Fuck you, YouTube. Fuck you, Whoa. at YouTube. Rat. <laughs> the ad is funny. Like, nobody <laughs> reads that one. Like, if you actually want someone to read it, don't tag at YouTube, dummy. Like, what are you talking about? That shit gets tagged probably, like, literally 100,000 times a day. <laughs> Nobody's going through it. That doesn't work either! Such a coward. Steven Coward. I'd love to talk to him. I would actually talk to him. <laughs> Well, she didn't invite him to an interview. <laughs> probably I'm sure he's gonna probably not yeah, happening I'm sure this time. He'd be real open to that. <laughs> I thought Ethan was a stand-up guy. <laughs> well, yeah, I don't think that's happening. I thought Ethan was a stand-up guy. Don't know what gave you that idea, buddy. Ah, <sighs> well, so sorry, Crowder. So sorry. Uh, did you? Did we mention that you um, abuse your wife? come up a few times on the yeah. show. Yeah, just wanted to make sure that we don't forget that. Yeah, no. you... <laughs> right. No! <laughs> um, you know, I was watching clips of this girl Farah on um, the live yesterday for members, and people want more. Here, uh, I'll show you sure guys. What? This is the girl from TikTok. That's how I know her. Farah Khalidi. And she's been on Fresh and Fit, and she's been on whatever. She actually even debated Rolo Tony Brown Town. Rolo Tony Brown Town. Who's 53 years old, and he's still on these shows talking about hookup culture. <laughs> he's the godfather, 53, right? bro. <laughs> we have that clip in here, too. This guy's gonna be wheeling around the wheelchair in the fucking convalescent home talking about, or the, not, the old folks home talking about pickup culture and shit, out of <laughs> bang grannies. What are you afraid of, Ian? Uh, here, check this out. Question after everyone, after this, we'll do the Fika set. Yeah. Position. Um, I'm a virgin. Oh, shit. Stop the cow! Oh! <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? I said, I'm a virgin. <laughs> stop the cow! This man straight up has a stop the cap button that he pushes in front of their face. Is that so embarrassing, Graham? <laughs> He could just say it. Like, he could just <laughs> That's say what I was it. thinking. Yeah. Just say that. Right. It's yeah. like having his own applause button where he pushes it. He's like... Yeah, it's not It's not adding anything spe Like, Zach makes it special with the sound bites. Thank you. Well, and of, of course, course, it's not me. It's not... Uh, beautiful. It's not me ha backing right. me up. Yeah, like... Mm. No, but I'm in, I'm in your brain, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So... You're in he my wall. He yeah. to it. He just spoke to himself. It was yeah. embarrassing. I, that gap. It's I, like him being like, yo, anyway. And he's like, that was funny. Hey, me, that was funny joke. <laughs> I, I've said this before. I'd love to give them a master class. I'd be more than happy to sit them down, show them how everything works. For free? Of course no. not. Yeah, Crazy. No. I was going to say. Um, top, top dollar. Yeah, top dollar. But, you know, just don't pacing, timing. It's all about the timing. Myron. Stop the cat. <laughs> It's all about the timing. Myron. All right, here it is. <laughs> Wait, can you say it again? Why? 
<laughs> why the air horn there? That again, <laughs> no context where the air horn. Oh no, that was is me. applicable. So th that was me. Oh, <laughs> sorry. All right, now you're confusing me, boy. <laughs> yeah. You're not a virgin. virgin. You're not a virgin. Come that on. That was him or you? That was him. <laughs> okay. I'm not doing it anymore. Okay. That They're one sucked. Dude, the record scratch kills me. All right, let's actually watch this. I've paused it. Let's just watch the fucking clip. Again. Wait, can you say it again? I'm dead ass. Yeah. Virgin. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. You're not a virgin. virgin. You're not a virgin. Come on. You got a polygraph test? Come on. <laughs> so the, the part that's really funny to me about this is they're obsessed with body count. Obsessed. And then when they find a girl who's never had sex, they're like, no, tell us you're a slut. Liar. You know you're a slut. <laughs> Come on. It's like, this is, this is what you want. And, but then you can't believe it exists. So then, what is it you really want? <laughs> Emotions. That's what we want. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this chick's hilarious, bro. You know, like dry humor. Yeah, she's, like, she's yeah, trying to literally. Yeah, yeah. She's uh, funny by not being funny. Yeah. Good analysis, oh. coconuts. Oh, I see what she's doing. I see what she's I doing. Somebody else who's really funny without without being <laughs> right. Funny. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, uh, she make she makes me laugh, but she not try. Uh, <laughs> How she do that? <laughs> I'm surprised Coconut's just not there, like, drooling. <laughs> so really Coconut's the only dude who could get a lobotomy and be smarter. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Audience, what do y'all think? Do y'all believe yeah. it or no? Stop the cat. For I some they're... reason, I believe her. I believe yeah, her. Yeah, I believe her. Wait, how old are you? 23. Wait, but you're the OnlyFans. Mm -hmm. So, Dude. hold on, hold on, this is added up. It's almost like taking pictures of, your, pictures of yourself is an equivalent to, like, putting a dick inside of you. <laughs> like, it's almost like you don't need one to do the other. Yes. You know I what mean, I mean? I, I, I know, I'm just saying, like, the activity could what? lead to, you know, penetration at some point. What the fuck? Why? Coconuts, you're the dumbest motherfucker alive. Correla boy. He's correlating to, th you can uh. say that about anything. You could be like, well, obviously lunch will lead into dinner one day. Like, yeah, yeah sir, uh. but they happen at two different times a day. <laughs> and they're not, <laughs> I don't eat what I have for lunch for dinner. It's hold not on. connected. Hold on, hold on. You're telling me that you live in a house with a man? Yeah, he's my dad, my brother. And you haven't had sex? <laughs> uh, One activity uh, could lead to the other. Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you what, man. If you opened his head, scooped out his brains, and put a coconut in there, I think his the processing power would, in, would increase. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, did, did you say you use toys? Yeah, I use, like, clip so, section. So no, I don't use toys. Oh! That's... Penetration. So hold on. <laughs> okay. Oh. So hold on. Hold on. Oh boy. Oh my oh, god. No. He, he doesn't know what the clit is. Self oh, we need to give him century, bro. We need to give Holy him some uh, some support here. Has oh, Myers yeah, 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 yeah. That's embarrassing. I mean, oh, I mean, so bad. you do this whole show about sex, and you're gonna expose like, oh, you're the problem, bro. You can't you can't sexually please anybody. Oh, that one hurt. That one hurt. Yeah, but. I have a question. If you use a dildo, you can. You're still a virgin if you haven't had yeah, sex. Yeah, of course. Well, because yeah. the concept of virginity is not real in the first. It's not like something specific happens and then boom, it's all done. Just, it's like there's obviously a spectrum. If like someone uses a dildo, someone could say that that is them losing. When you when you I don't know when you, when you jerk off, when you jerk off are you not a virgin? When a when a teenager jerks off for the first time, is he he lost his virginity? Like, no, obviously. No, yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I, mean, so. I think it's, it's like, having sex with somebody. Well, it's right. the ambiguity of, like, also uh, homosexual relationships. It's the, especially in the lesbian community, people, like, there's right, he a, defined a it as wide penetration, range so. of, yeah, okay, of okay, what you consider losing your virginity. So I guess I would, I would, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all subjective. It is all subjective. Uh, uh what, what do we got here? This is, uh. <laughs> but yeah, the, the line yeah. about the. Boy. What what is this, AB? They it, it holds your Alexa. You just it's like a just goes in there. I was saying I want a coconuts and Barbados version of one of these. That has his voice in it. No, just to 
Where you oh, come his out head. Out his brain. Yeah. That'd be kind of fire. <laughs> Coconuts, what is the clit? <laughs> uh, uh. He also reminds me, you know, you know, in the second Silence of the Lambs, Hannibal, yeah. where he's like serving him his own brain. Yeah, I sure do. Like, oh, that's really good. <laughs> oh God. Yeah, but uh, th- every time this guy talks, I see why he stays quiet, man. It's just yeah. not a good situation when he talks. Penetration at some point. What the um, fuck? Wait, did, did you say you use toys? Yeah, I use like clip so, suction. So no, I don't use toys. Oh, that's <coughs> penetration. They- uh, what? Uh. We got to pull that. We got to pull that, Zach. Oh, that's oh. penetration. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> penetration. I want to see the continuation of that. Yeah, he gets checked on that, right? Suction. He doesn't know what that All is. All the women. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Why are you a virgin? Why are you a virgin? You mean it just hits the clip? I'm very picky. Okay. <laughs> Dude, this is cat, bro. It's no. It's no Allah Akbar! Okay, that, that was a weird one. He hits the Allah Akbar. <laughs> is that what that was? Yeah, yeah. he hit an Allah no, Akbar. Man. Like, someone, tr- please try to extrapolate meaning uh, from that. Honestly, it was so extreme that it was funny. <laughs> Dude, this is cat, bro. It's no... It's no Allah Akbar! Why, why? Why the Allah Akbar? <laughs> because she's a virgin, so he's, what? That and, and, A.B., am I interpreting... Is that a certain type of Allah Akbar? That I can the say... Sa- yeah, the sound bite is, is definitely meant to indicate, like... Unaliving yourself. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So I can I can make yeah. that. I mean, Allah Akbar. We say every day when we pray. But right. Of we don't yeah, scream it, it out like that. It sounds like it's being yelled in like anger. I guess so. that kind of yeah. Thing. Like so, if I ever yell that out, y'all better duck. So the only w- <laughs> I wouldn't duck, bro. I would I would I would grab you and say we we go together, brother. Oh hell yeah, we'll make peace in the Middle East with that. Mm-hmm. Aww. Yeah. The only thing I can think of. Is that this motherfucker thought because she's a virgin that when you Allah Akbar yourself or I don't know if that's the right I way. think you're thinking way too advanced. Uh, when you when well, you blow your when you martyr yourself, you go to heaven and get a bunch of virgins. Right, yeah. So he's like, I'm ready to do it. I I think, I don't know think if you're giving him that much credit. But why? Why would he hit it? It makes well, no I, sense. Let me just clarify that because I get I get shit when I don't clarify that. That that's not actually a thing. What's not a thing? Like Doing that and then going to heaven and they're being like, "Oh, you, okay." Yeah. Thanks for the clarification. I don't <laughs> think you need to say that, but yeah. But also, she has an Arab name. Have we? Have we? Uh, oh, that's a weird, another shitty angle mm-hmm. that they, he could be taking. Yeah. Well, I feel like it's inappropriate. But isn't it like suggesting that she just shocked them? Like dropped a Allah Akbar. How is that dro- announced? Shock. He's that's meaning like, like they dropped the bomb. Yeah, I, I feel. I feel like it's inappropriate for even me to suggest that, but I think that's how he's thinking. Hmm. She dropped a bomb? Yeah, I saw people suggest that when I watched it. That's fucking... What? Oh! That's... Penetration! I just said clit suction. suction. He doesn't know what that is. I don't know what oh. the fuck that is. Why are you a virgin? Why are you a virgin? You mean I just... hits the clit? I'm very picky. Okay. Dude, this is cat, bro. It's no. It's no <laughs> I'm sorry. I just can't deal with that. See, he does it in frustration. I feel like it, he's using it as like a. He wants to kill himself. He, yeah, or and everyone around him. Yep. <laughs> it it means uh, the translation is Allah is or God is great. Right. So maybe just like a virgin. I don't fucking know. Yeah, why wouldn't like, you guys why don't her? you believe her? Why would I lie? I'm very because I just high body count. True. Yeah, somebody in chat confirmed this, man. Who can <laughs> confirm this? <laughs> somebody in chat confirmed it. <laughs> well, you are dumb. He opens his mouth. It's 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 it's, it's astonishing. <laughs> Wait, user one eight six says that uh, he banged you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, how do you explain that? <laughs> Poopfeast four twenty says he's fucked you. Your thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> um, there's one other one with her that I like of her owning Rolo Tony Browntown, and then we can we'll do the Fika, dude. This guy is such a loser, bro. Look at him. <laughs> what do you mean? He do oh, Rolo Tony Browntown. God damn it! We don't want to hear it. That's why. Yeah. 
and a guy so that you will have sex with them. For me, romantic chemistry is incredibly volatile. It's not based on any barometers of like, oh, he's in school, he has this career or anything. So it could me. just be a random dude off the street. 100%. I am not hypergamous at all. So you are so hypergamous, you won't have sex with a guy until the guy is the guy that you're looking for. Of course. And then if I had had sex with guys and then they made less than me, and then you'd say, oh, because we broke up, it proves that none of those interactions counted, right? I think the very, I think the fact that you are a virgin right now just proves a point that you're high, like to a very high degree. The fact that I'm abstinent means that I'm waiting for someone richer than me. No, no, no. hypergamy doesn't mean women are bad. When did I say bad? When did I even imply that? Hypergamy is just an algorithm. It's an evolutionary adaptation that women have. It's not a negative or positive thing. I'm it's not fine. sure if it's an evolutionary adaptation. I think the reason women have historically been hypergamous is because they were barred from higher education. So obviously the average man was going to earn more than them. But by 2050, we're going to see a total reversal hypergamous, of hypergamy. Uh, hyper hypergamy existed before there was money. Hypergamy has nothing to do with money. I'm using the current definition of hypergamy, which is that women date someone with a superior sociological or monetary background. What would Ideal be your These guys are so dumb. And she is You're so never gonna She's get so that. smart. Yeah, I, I mean, love her. yeah. This is there was actually one where she's owning Rolo, where he was saying, uh, ugh, there was another one of her owning Rolo, and I, I have a thing for, for watching Rolo get dunked on. Oh, that's just want to, Yeah, I'll be careful scrolling that. Just want to point out that Rolo's definitely dyeing his hair, 110%. Penetration. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, whatever. She's, she's great. Go check her out. Uh, she tours these podcasts and embarrasses these guys. With all that being said, we've saved the best for last. Mm -hmm. Sam has been in the laboratory. She has been preparing the fika. The fika. <laughs> the fika. Fika for life. Fika for life. She has gone and done the impossible, apparently. Or we'll see, theoretically, the most disgusting, vile shit that any of us have ever smelled or tasted is about to be prepared in a scrumptious style that we can all eat and enjoy. Some say it couldn't be done. Some still say it couldn't be done. Yet we're here to try. Here's Sam. With... Thank you. I got a little margarita dish. Is this just uh, gamer that stuff? That is strawberry daiquiri gamer stuff. Mmm, very nice. Chopsticks? Wow. Yeah, I can use chopsticks. I'm scared, though, of what that means. I'm not doing any sashimi, am I? Don't you serve me no sashimi. Girl. Am I not the only one trying this, right? No, I think some... Some others will be trying it. I tried them all last night. Okay. Okay, that's good that you survived that. I will say that I'm the one that has allergic reactions to this shit. So, if anyone should be trying, it's Dan. Dan doesn't eat fish. What about for a gag? I can't stand Dan! Me, you, you nailed that one, Rich. Alright. Dan, block me! <laughs> That's Rich Lux, of course. So here I've got my chopsticks. Farewell, Fika fish. Uh, it's been nice. I see there's young Lean back here enjoying some fika. Mm-hmm. Two As, Swedish kings right there. Who's this guy? Is that the king? That's the king. Swedish king. King. Carl Gustav. Carl Gustav. I wonder if Carl Gustav gets down with fika. Probably. Is that Ivan Drago on the other side? Yep, that's Dolph Lundgren. And then Ethan... He got cancer last week. No. Oh, no way. I think so. Shit. Wait, what did he do? This guy? He was the Russian in Rocky IV. What did he get cancelled for? Cancer. Oh, cancer. I guess that's cancelled in a way. Yeah. That's, that's, that's when God cancels you. Yeah, God cancels you. Damn. He's a Swedish legend. That sucks. He's a, did he, he didn't die, he just has it. Yeah, he no, just... No, it's just battling. Yeah. Good, good luck, brother. Pretend yeah, good like luck, that, Dolph. Sh that shit's like Rocky, you fucking, you know what I mean? Didn't he win? Yeah. Yeah. No, he got no, it. No, he lost. He lost oh, the rock. Yeah. Oh. 
fuck. He, he killed, killed Apollo. Apollo. Yeah. yeah. Oh shit. Okay, well, treat yeah, treat that cancer like Apollo. Kill it. So as we wait here, uh, meditate on the importance of Fika to the Swedish people. And I think, well, what is important in all of our lives, I wonder? In my life? Something like Fika that's important to me? Penetration. <laughs> Is uh, trying to find the clit. Still haven't found it. Still looking. All right, here comes the first dish. Now I don't want to be the only one tasting this shit. Oh my Game god! Game goddess, this is Ian. Holy fuck, dude! Are you serious right now? I'm serious right dude, now. Dude, what the fuck? That is so much. I mean, it looks amazing, but like, oh my god, no, please, I can't eat that. Do you want me to tell you what it is? Yes, please. This is Sir Stroming in a yuzu ponzu sauce with cilantro, pickled serrano chili, and a lemon piece on top. Holy fuck. And you ate this? I did eat that. You had a whole bite? Yes. And how was it? I thought this one was totally fine. I can't do it. Who's eating this? Here, I'm going to pass out the others. Look at the chunk. I mean, it's such a big piece of fish, man. Good day to be a vegetarian, huh? Like that, Sam, did you try this? This one? <clears throat> Okay. The only thanks, Sabi. The only one who's actually ever eaten any of this is Ian. So any anything of this. Zach took a bite. I don't know if he held it down though. Oh, I spit it up. Okay. That is fragrant. I mean, even after all you've processed that, it is fragrant. I'm sure if I got close. Yeah, but I have to get pretty close to it. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's nothing like. No. Normal. The Bro, I don't know that I I can't I don't know 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 I hate this I don't like this bit. <laughs> well, you have you have uh, three more after this, so. All right, who's 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 gonna eat this? You're gonna do it, Olivia. I'm okay, going. Good. I'm going into. Okay, good. Because I'm allergic, right? So. We don't actually know that, do we? Every time I've eaten it, I've I've broken out. You didn't eat it, you like... It's licked it! What happens if I'm gonna eat it? I'm gonna drop dead. You, you were getting rashes from all kinds of shit the last... I just tried to pick it up and the two... I thought it was two separate pieces. It's two kind of cut pieces connected Wait. by skin. No, there's... Here, look, Dan. There's skin on the bottom. And it's slimy looking. Oh. Mm. Oh, no. Make sure you get all of... It together, it makes Ian, it easier. Ian, you eat really? it. I don't think Shut I can do up, this. Really? I swear to God, I don't no, think like I can do the, it. The pepper, the cilantro, the lemon, it all needs to be on there as a unit. Oh. No. All right, who's going first? I'll go first. All right, good man. Ugh. I can smell it, dude. It, it is stinky. It is stinky. When you play with it a little bit. Nope. Zach is <laughs> gave it a valiant effort, but he ejected it. <laughs> no. What no. happened? Is the flavor I, still I, there? I it, I think I just have PTSD from. Right. I think it's a mental wall. It smells though. Well, what was the taste like? Uh, it's in my mouth. It's a little spicy from the, the jalapeno, but I I taste the fucking fish, man. I can smell it more. Smell it now that I played with it a little bit. Oh. I am so sad. Oh, I got, I got a decent whiff of it that time. You guys are being kind of rude to Sam, in my opinion. No, yeah. Sam's amazing. I mean, no disrespect it's, to Sam. It's, it's unfortunate she works that the fish she is works. what it is. Kim Kardashian. I, God, I work yet. and I work and I work. Kim oh, Kardashian. it stinks, man. Just get, just eat it. You eat it, dude. Let's see. I don't eat fish. Well, I don't right, eat stuff I'm allergic to. Let's keep okay. it going. Olivia, are you going for it? Yep. Olivia. Do I oh. eat the whole piece of fish? You gotta eat, you put the whole thing. You yeah. gotta do Fuck a whole off, bundle there. Really? One bite. It's just one bite. You can do it. Everybody you got this. Rules. One bite. Literally die. <laughs> one bite, keep it healthy or whatever. <laughs> you got this. You're a champion. Have <laughs> this ready. What is that for? That's not gonna help. For me to literally spit it out into. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. 
I was like, that ain't big enough for whatever you got. <laughs> it's lingering in my mouth, man. My body isn't letting me put it closer to my mouth. Go ahead, you got this, girl. You are in command. Yes, Olivia put it in. She's chewing. She doesn't look happy with it at all, but she's chewing. Is nope. she, has, is she, she's, yeah, she spit it out. <laughs> Didn't last very long. Ugh. I can deal with it. Sam, I love what you did with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I agree. I mean, it looks, it looks amazing. If any other fish, you know, that, <laughs> that can't be okay to Here's eat. Here's the thing, because all the flavors are so incredible, except for the fish. Yeah. Right. Like, 100%. I know that if that were on, like, an albacore tuna, I would eat the shit out of it. Yeah. I can't. Like, I love you, Sam, so much. You're so beautiful and so amazing. I just sadly don't like Pika fish. <laughs> is this the one that you like, Sam, or was it a different? Oh, no. So this is the as good as it gets. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, I had to uh, taste test this one as well. It's not, it's not that bad. It's not. It's a mental game. Again, Sam, no disrespect to you. I apologize. <laughs> yeah, I just, no. I just, I can't. Is anyone else going to do this? You. Nobody else? AB? Mm, no, more. Come on, AB. No, that's okay. It's like in my beard now, man. Come on, bro. Back me up, dude. Lena would do it. Probably. Yeah. If you do it, I'll do it. You have you to. Gotta do it. We you need have to do it. We did this whole thing I'm only, for you. I'm only doing it if AB does it. What? What is this? I can't do it. I told Olivia I wouldn't puke. I'm definitely going to puke. So? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Come on, look Cam, at Cam, anybody? Oh, you know what? I'll, I'll break my vegetarian streak for this. Oh, really? shit. I will. Well, AB, I'll uh, give you. Okay, well, do here, you have Cam. yours, AB? Let yeah. me console you, Cam. Okay. The chance that you even swallow it seems pretty slim. Based, I on feel like area. I could. This is my toxic trick: is that I feel like I could eat the fika Let's fish. Let's see. Cam who, can eat it all. He who can should I have? You can have mine. It's tiny. Okay. Hold on. Oh. How small? Because if it's small, I want it. <laughs> it's really small. Yeah, I'll run it to Cam. Thank you very much. So, Ethan, are you gonna have it if I have it? Because I want to see you eat it. I'm gonna try it. Okay. Hell yeah. Just do it, man. Just go. Thank you. Thank I mean, you. again, it doesn't oh, look that bad on camera. Much. But that's got to be a slimy-ass, nasty motherfucker. How did you prepare this, Sam? Oh, yeah, hold on. <laughs> She's nowhere near a mic. Do you want to try it? Cam is going in. Ready? Cam's Moment got it. Team. He's gone. How do, you, how do you say, is there anything in Swedish that I can say? Skål. 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 That's for Drew. Oh, I get it. Cam is chewing. He's things. You guys are overreacting. Did you I ever? I had a feeling. Okay, hold on. Did you ever participate in the fika? I smelled it. I never put it in my mouth. But so you don't have that association. I smelled it. I got my face up to it. I think it's fine. I think it tastes pretty good. Oh my god. There you go. We got it pretty good. Yep. Sam, how did you prepare this? So I let it marinate in the yuzu ponzu sauce overnight and I put a little bit of the juice on the plate and then I just slice the rest and put it on top. It's, it's very simple. It's if very, you've ever if you've ever had yellowtail jalapeno, that yum. was the, the inspo. So it's not cooked. No. But it's it's, it's, well, it's fermented in the yeah it's, it's sashimi. Totally safe. I mean yeah. when when What does that mean? <laughs> sashimi. <laughs> that doesn't well, mean it, shit. It's to me. fish. You don't have to cook it. Yeah every yeah. other time we've had it it's never been cooked. Yeah it was right out of the can once sitting out for a day. Well, and it's been it was refrigerated. refrigerated. It was refrigerated. Yeah. Yeah. It's preserved. It's, it's safe. It's bitch fine. Goes back I ate it. I'm bro. fine. I don't know about all that shit. Man. It's wicked salty. That's that's my only. If complaint. it was yellowtail, any other type of fish, salmon, even a like a bad fish that just wasn't fika, and we, Sam made it, I would eat that up. We just have such. Awful... Why did you give me such a big one though? They're you, all that can size. Can you cut it Sorry. in half? Do me a favor, please. Fuck it, I just gotta do this. Being such just a do it, do it. Shut up, man, you try it. I don't eat fish. Yeah, well, exactly, so so who are you to even say anything? If I did eat Look fish, that, though, I'd to totally do it. it. It's really not that bad. See, I know how bad it's gonna be. It's just salty, it's wicked salty. Care, you, you had, you have Zach and Olivia's reactions to go off of. Both of them are, are fairly... It's not gonna kill you. Dramatic. Okay. I know it's not gonna kill me. Well, yeah, I my, that. I'm the only one that had <laughs> allergic reactions to it. You got this. Doesn't You're a champion. Doesn't it look huge? Dude, just do it. 
Bro, I swear to God, I don't know if I can do this. Down the hatch. You can do it. Why is so much skin? <laughs> Just Hit the it. fish. Yeah, it's fish. I mean, uh... yeah. Hit the fish, bro. Just hit the fish. Just hit the fish. Hit the fish. Just hit that fish. Hey, hit the fish. Hit the fish. Can I cook it a little, little bit on the candle? Right? The oh, come on. Cook the so fish and then hit that fish. Let me cook it a little bit. The that puffer seems, That's going to make it worse. Nice that's going to make it worse. Yeah. Get a nice sear that's on it. Definitely going to make I'm going to count worse. down. I'm going to count down. You're going to do it. You're going to get that like. No, you're not. Wick taste now. I'm going to do it. Oh. Hit the fish. Fuck, I hate this bit. Just say skull and then eat it. <laughs> this yeah, if you say skull, it gives you the bravery. To fit in yeah. This trash can? yeah. Here's a gravy dish. <laughs> <laughs> Young Gravy sent us his Dr. Cla Dr. Pepper collab. I'm gonna look at the show the gravy dish. Yeah, that's where the feek is going. Then straight onto my chicken. <laughs> Alright, fuck my asshole. Fuck my tight little asshole. Skull. 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 Fucking put the Goliath up my ass. I it's love that fish. Hunger's like, the toys I use have names like Goliath, mm -hmm. and the giant, the, the colossal. You're killing time here. He goes, the toys I use got name like the blue whale, the bronchiosaurus, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. supernova. Hit the fish. Fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Fuck. I'm just... Uh, fuck. Down AB, how are you not going to do this, AB? It's not fair. If I'm going to do this, you're going to do this. I just went in there to help Sam. The next one smells so fucking awful. Bro. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. Okay, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Does anyone have an EpiPen? <laughs> oh, my God. I just want to make sure we have an EpiPen, because if we don't have an EpiPen, I can't do it. It's not safe. Uh, yeah, we, we, we have one. Okay. Pussy! Okay, I got one in my, in my backpack. Do you have any anti-venom? Yeah, I got a lot of that, too. There you go. Oh, <laughs> and there you go. Here comes, the airplane. Here comes the airplane. Here we go. Into Tower 7. Here it is. Here we go. Whoop. Okay, Cam, now's not the time to be joking about that. Down the hat. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I've, been, I've been waiting to hit you with that Allah Huek bar as soon as you bite it. <laughs> <laughs> That's not going to help. Here it is. It's in the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> you got it all. Up. It's loaded up. It's ready to go. Nothing to wait on now. Here we go. And, oh, it's in. He's biting. To it, yeah. Let him cook. Oh, oh come on. So primal. That's my garbage. That is so subprimal. Haram! <laughs> God fuck me in the asshole. <laughs> <laughs> well. Nobody should eat that. I don't know why it exists. I'm so glad that fish, the fish are all dying. <laughs> no, we love the fish. And here comes round two. Oh wow, that looks lovely. This one actually smells really good. All right. That one at least looks like there's more to dampen the flavor. Yeah. Wait, you didn't I like, like this that's... one? Um, this one I didn't like it at first, but then I tweaked it, so okay. I think it might be better. Is there wasabi you know, on here? No, no wasabi. No, I'll say this: this. Um... I, I I put enough time to taste the flavors. You did a good job of diminishing it. It's still there, though. It's still there subtly enough. I think in all of these, it's still there. Yeah, it's a little. still there. Oh, good, it's it's warm. it's almost impossible to get rid of that. It's such intense salt. Like, it's just, you can't. It's just got that ass. Like, I don't know how to describe mocha, it. It's like you know, salty ass. Cream. Yeah, they're all different yeah. flavors. So this next one is uh, spicy surshroming over crispy rice with smashed avocado and pickled serrano chili and Dude. eel sauce. Dude, this is crazy because I would get the fuck down with that if it was anything else. Literally. Yeah. Like, that looks amazing. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Can Thank you, you try sir. the first piece? I tried this one. But you said you didn't it. like it. I tried it after I tweaked it. And is it, did you I like think it? it's better. Okay. It's certainly better. Ian, have you tried this one? I tried the pre-tweaked uh, version. How'd you feel about it? Pre-tweak. Uh, there's definitely some room for improvement. 
Okay. Are you talking now? When you say room for improvement, are you just talking about the dish or the fika? The the way of masking the thought that it is fika fish uh, needed some help. Uh, so hopefully that I don't like the sound of a little better. But I don't know, Zach. You want to give it a go? Yeah, I'm gonna hit it. Ugh. Go ahead. I mean, it looks better than the last one. You know, I'm gonna let you eat that first. Zach's put it in. He's oh. crunching. He seems unbothered, actually. Relatively unbothered by Zach. He's crunching. He's chewing. He's thinking. Is he gonna abort? Mm. He's got it this time. You got it, dude. Has he, he got it? Or like it's it's abort? ready for swallowing at this point. You're good. He's you, got a thumbs up. He's getting thumbs up. Yo! Wow. There you go. Oh, wow. There you nice. go. Well done. Well done. I was. It, it's definitely not as extreme as mm -hmm. the first one. It's We're, still there. I'm not gonna lie. Were you able to appreciate the flavor profile of the fika fish no, at all? The with it being part. the worst part. It's the worst part. Okay. It's, it's the smell. It gets in your. It's just vile. Yeah. A fuck herring fish. I hope they all die. We love the herring. What do they use herring for other than fika? I don't know. Well, delis have fucking creamed herring. Yeah, I'm saying it's all nasty. Yeah. Nobody needs herring. You know, the the whole, like, masking part that you guys are talking about, that, I feel like, is the whole purpose with the Swedish dish, because they really try to hide that shit. They cut it in tiny pieces and shit. So it's like a game to just make it <laughs> taste as little yeah. of its original flavor as possible. <laughs> Sounds like, like a really cool food. Why eat it, then? Exactly. Well, I'm not the main person, or audience who eats it. Guys, I've got this crazy idea. The dude who invented the zipper, he goes, okay, now on to my next idea. Uh, he modified the zipper. <laughs> he goes, let's make Arcadic. the most vile, disgusting, fucking freak shit that you can't even open in your house. Your house will be cursed for a week. And then, let's take it and try to make it not taste anything like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's the game. Do you like locks, Ethan? No. You don't like smoked salmon? No, I don't. See, I love that shit. Jew are you? What the fuck? You don't like locks? I tried telling people I'm not a Jew. Leave me the fuck alone. Everybody's saying, oh, you're Jew. You're Jew. <laughs> yeah. Whatever, bro. You need they might be on to something. All right. So, Olivia, your turn. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad. It's not Zach, bad. Zach ate that yeah. one. It's, I know. This one will probably... It's probably pretty good. By the way, when love arrives, his ass is eating all this nasty shit. Yeah, you're eating a whole thing. Including spicy chips. There's no more fika food, though. Oh, you just mean like in general? Chip, I'm not eating the yeah. whole thing, sorry. You have to. You no. have to. I mean, no, 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 it's easier. Trust if you me. bite through it, I think it's going to be harder. Yeah, you have to all in. Because if you, it's not going to, it's not going to break apart elegantly. It's going to be a whole nightmare. It's I'd be rather your... it be ugly than all in my mouth. All right, if you want to bite it in half, I, I'm, I, I think not, but go for it. See, it's not going to no cut. Fish You're not getting any fish. You didn't get any the of the fish. I... <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. right, so is the fact that you gagging making you gag more because i know you have a puke thing oh it stinks like, so bad uh, smell it dan i don't like put your nose right up on it dan it's in, my, it's in my like mustache nothing no i smell it i don't know it it's it's tough because it tastes like the the stuff that's obviously not that tastes so good. It does. I won't say that it smells good, but like I do, like the, the heavily fermentedness in the context of something like that. I, I get where they're coming from. I still don't think I would like it, but Dan, you I can't stand that. It's so easy for you to sit here and be like, "Oh no, I get it." Uh, you asked. So eat it. Not Dan is jealous of me. It's true. Okay, Cam, your turn. See, Cam gets it. He's all in. Cam's Cam's like the dude who will eat any damn thing. Not true at all. Not true at all. He's literally a vegetarian until today. Cam's chewing. He's thinking. He's mm -hmm. he's Probably also from, a little he's bit. from New England. He knows seafood. You know that salty seafood. Yeah. Vibe. Um, he's on that. You struggling a little bit, huh? You're struggling a little, a little bit. bit. It's a lot, but yeah. I'm not gagging or anything. I don't know. It's it's. It's gross, but it's not the most disgusting thing. How does it rate to the first dish you had? Honestly, the, the first dish was a lot easier to swallow because it was smaller, but... This I don't like the sound of. Uh, it's gross? I uh, prefer the first one, I think. Oh my god. Yeah. Really? 
I think so. Yeah, Zach would yeah. like this one more. So I feel like the the avocado and the the jalapeno, um, <laughs> and the jalapeno. rice cake. I feel like the rice cake helps with the consistency. That I will say. Well, this is good for jalapeno. my diet. I can guarantee I'm not going to want to eat anything for the rest of the oh, day. There you, True. There you go. That's lovely. I'm so fucking disgusted with this right now. Bile. Yeah. I'm shaking. All right. One second. Yeah, I don't think you're. No, maybe that's why people Swedish Swedish people are skinny. Yeah, because their food's terrible. And love, you said this yeah. is like a northern <laughs> Swedish thing, right? Not where you're. It, the problem is, it yeah. looks really good. Just think it's it's spicy Pretend, tuna. Yeah. Just think it's spicy tuna. Spicy tuna on there. Not pretending shit, dude. I can smell shit on my goddamn food. Yeah, the smell is brutal. It's very bad. <laughs> Just go. Just go, man. You got it. You got this. You so have this. <laughs> Thank you. Don't be the, shy. Thank you for the backup material. On the, uh... <laughs> <laughs> All right, here I go. Down here the hatch. Go. Bottoms up. Here we go. All Taking right. a bite. First bite. Here we go. All righty. Here comes the choo-choo train. Oh, and by the way, there's a stink emanating now from the trash can that I already spit the first round in. Right. Uh -huh. How many of these are there? This no. is the last one, right? Two more. Love Two more? That. You got to just power through it. I can't. Dive in. There it goes. And down the hatch. It's so big. Engage the mastication. The chewing... I, I don't. I. It's too big, Fuck. dude. I got. I can't do this shit. You go. You go. Oh, there it God. is. Thank you very much. Thank you for tuning into the H3 podcast. We'll see you tomorrow. I, I definitely think the bigness of the actual pieces of fish fucks you. Because in the Swedish dish, they're tiny, dude. They cut those motherfuckers down big time. Ethan is. It was pretty small. Over in our kitchen right now, looking for a chaser. I think. What's the little? Um... Wait, let me just say real quick. I, I play the alahuac butter. Don't don't blame Zach for that. Also, if this is cut and uh, posted as a highlight without the previous segment. Uh, giving the context, that's gonna seem pretty insane, so. <laughs> that's how we roll, baby. That's how we roll, I guess. You know, we're crazy over here, we're wild. I see a little piece of information from, uh, from Dan over there, that herring are a good source of vitamin D. Yeah, the random AB. <laughs> vitamin D's <laughs> not. Random AB yeah. fact of the day. Not worth it. Love, which Swedish table are you sitting at? Are you sitting at a Carl Gustav's table, or are you sitting at a PewDiePie's table? Uh, oh, damn, that's kind of hard. Shit. You actually uh, split my uh, idols pretty well here. Um, right, because are you going to stay loyal to Pewd, or are you going to stay loyal to uh, Young Lee? Young yeah. Lee, Lindor. I don't know, like, that actor uh, that very well. Um, hmm. Man. He is a legend. I can't answer this, bro. I don't know if I, I don't know if I want to continue this. No, you got to try the Swedish one though. I mean, Sam worked so hard on this. She slaved in the kitchen all day yesterday. You try it then, Dan. You destroyed our Can't. apartment with this. Uh, destroyed their apartment. Oh. At least we could show it off, you know. Well, e Love keeps saying there's supposed to be smaller bites. They're giving us like fat there's sashimi not, bites. There's not that much in here. It's a tiny. It's like this big. Let yeah, that looks pretty small. You can't even see it. Here, put it down. I can show the audience. You mean you can't see it? It looks like a swamp. It looks like a fucking well, because, swamp scum. So this one is cauliflower puree with the little pieces of crumbing, brown butter sauce with crispy noodles. So how big is the sum strum? Here, you should, you should. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Here, here. I'll repeat. Um, I'll hold this. This is cauliflower puree with surstroming and crispy capers and brown butter sauce on top. Delicious. It sounds beautiful. Wait, did 100%. you try it, Zach? Or... No, it, 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 minus it the, the turd stunning. nuggets on uh, fika fish, it looks delicious. Mm -hmm. You know. Artisan, even. Done All it. right, go ahead, Zach. It looks like it's from that movie, The Menu. 
You know? <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> Which, by the way, that movie fucked up with my mind. Um, all right. Zach, can I do some sound bites while you're doing this on Dan's computer? Uh, sure. I need to ask him permission. <laughs> Go for it. Why'd you ask his permission? Okay, bitch. Because, uh, you know, he's a, he's, a, he's, a, he's a master of his craft. I don't delicate want Delicate artist? You know? Yeah. Are you a delicate artist, Zach? Yes. Okay. Bitter bone. Bitter mm. bone. Zach went in for a clean bite. Probably real. Uh oh. No, no, Zach is not. <laughs> Why into the little cup? Oh. Don't buy it. You see, he's spitting it out into a little coffee cup. Yeah. You could tell. But didn't you hear Sam say it's just a tiny piece? You taste it, man. Mm. You taste that shit. I'm not tasting anything. I'm out. You're Come out, on, man. Such a puss. Dan, if you eat it, I'll eat it. I'm not gonna eat you cannot one? say shit. I, I, you can't say shit. You're infringing shit on my me. beliefs right now. Okay, but I'm just saying you can't say shit. A, I'm gonna speak to HR. The right. the cauliflower puree was magnificent, Sam. That flavor was fantastic. It was just the uh, the, the the fucking overwhelming of rotting asshole. Mm -hmm. mm. Garbage. There you go. All right, Olivia. She's shaking. She looks not. She's scared. not gonna be able to swallow this one. Got <laughs> 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 a shot now, dude. She looks so sad. I feel like the consistent the mashed potatoes were excellent, but the consistency does not help. It's just a gooey, mm. gooey right. mess. Right. Right. Mm. The, the real question is, can Cam eat it? So far, he's undefeated. Yeah. Here we go. Down the hatch. Let's go, man. Bottoms up. It's not your fault. <laughs> Any time now. It's like when you're about to jump into like jump rope. It's happening. She's, she's preparing. <laughs> Lots of hesitancy. She's... Thinking about it, here she goes. Oh, she took just a little sip up <laughs> front. I don't even think she got the fika fish. Clap if you think she should. She just up. got a little nick off the that front mashed there. Mashed potatoes is hitting. <laughs> <laughs> Again, magnificent flavor. It lives flavor. in the cauliflower puree. <laughs> yeah. Did you, Sam? Did you cook it into the puree? The brown butter sauce is is absolutely delightful. It's divine. It, it's divine. Yeah, it <laughs> All right, Cam. Let's see if you can if you can be the sole victor here. Okay. This fuck is gonna do it, no problem. Everybody, scoop it, skull. Here goes skull. It's like eating skull. an oyster. Yeah, I scooped it down like an oyster. Oh, even Cam is grimacing now. It's the consistency. <laughs> yeah, that one was weird. He yeah. threw it back though. Yeah, I ate it, but it was fucking weird. I'm not doing it. Let's just keep it moving. This show, it's just gonna be forever. I'm sorry, everybody. You know, such a coward. Fuck, you cannot say <laughs> shit, man. You're a fucking coward for being a vegetarian. It's not. It's that's bravery. It's bravery. Do we have a? It takes bravery to be a vegetarian. Do we have milk? Milk wash in the house by any chance? Now Cam's asking for mouthwash. I mean, guys. I mean, well, my breath smells like kids. shit. It does smell like shit now. I have kids. Damn it! Don't you guys have any? Don't you care about my children at all? Two young boys that need their dad. Look at that. Alive. In the, in the camera shot, it looks quite delightful, don't you think? Has kids. I had a really long day. Mm -hmm. There's no babysitter tonight. If I get sick, also lazy. I don't leave the house usually. Good luck, Ethan. <laughs> How nice that looks. Bro, or May, dude. I'm, dra I'm dragging it out, and I know it's just not that interesting to watch, but I can't, I can't do it. Tell yourself, I can do this. It'll mm -hmm. change your mindset. Just say it. No, yeah. I'm take not going to tell you, myself take that. Take it you make it. I'm Manifest. Gonna you gotta do it. Manifest the courage. Pussy. Mm hmm I mean, Pussy. what are you going to see? You just going to spit it out? I mean, Olivia, she tried. Or you may love it. What if you like this one? That's not happening. Different strokes for different folks. This one might... This might be your new favorite dish. Yep. You can see the fish hairs. Look at this. The fish, fish hairs? Yeah. I've never met a hairy fish before. Airy Fish, the name of my proctologist. <laughs> yeah, you can see it. So thick. Hold on, the auto autofocus is struggling on this fika fish. Guys, I I'm sorry, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm sorry. Wow. I'm just not doing it. 
I'm saying no. I'm sorry, guys. I have to. I just. I have to do this for myself. You know, there's. Uh, listen, listen. I do a lot for this show. I'm not doing this. <laughs> Check, please. Thank you all for tuning in to the. I, I give it all to the for this show. I'm not. I just can't. I'm sorry. Well, at least can we take a look at the last? Let's dish. just move it along. Yeah. Let's just move. All right. It let's along. take a look at the fourth dish and maybe. Here, can you agree right now that you'll eat no. either this one or the fourth? Well, wait until you see the fourth. What Let the fourth me see the works? fourth one. Bring it out. Maybe this one won't seem Dan, that bad. you don't comparison. get to talk to me. I, I, I feel like that's really illegal for you to say that to me right now. Don't talk to me. I can't stand Dan. <laughs> based off of my, based off of my beliefs. Here's Ian reporting from yesterday. Sam was cooking uh, these masterpieces. I'm I'm walking into the house. Can you see that? And it fucking stinks in here. <laughs> oh my god. A fucking Can you not the... smell this anymore? Bro. Oh my god. I don't smell anything. Hold the fucking Just... phone. Why are they... what's with all these dumbass buttons here? Double click the window. I did. This one? Just hit the green uh, one on like the top left. That button. This. Yeah. Stupid ass Max, dumb, stupid yeah, computer. Idiot Mac. Hate Apple. <laughs> I'm I'm walking into the house and it fucking stinks in here. <laughs> oh my god. Can you not smell this anymore? No. Oh my god. I don't smell anything. I don't smell anything. It is so <laughs> foul in here. I don't smell anything. Oh my god. I smell nothing. <laughs> it's disgusting. Oh, do we have any footage of you cooking, Sam? Yeah, I'm editing it right now. Oh, you're editing it. All right, let me see the last one. Again, presentation's great. Wow. Um... So this is the classic uh, fika way. Yeah, that's the Swedish style. Okay, th this like this I'll eat the last one. Okay. This Hell one, yeah. I, this one looks interesting. So this one is no shock, uh, Dan. So this one is a little like Swedish flatbed flatbread cracker with two potato slices, sir strumming sour cream. Oh my God. Red onion and chives. This is great. Mm -hmm. Like this is a, nice. this is looks beautiful. And, and uh, I mean, if it wasn't for the, I would I would tear this up, dude. I, I gotta say, you hit hit the nail on the head. That looks so, just oh, like. Oh, thank you. And the yeah, amount. It looks like of, a small version of what we get. Thank you. Very good. Thank you. The amount of fish looks correct to you. It's like a whole fillet up in there. Uh, I can't really it's see small. by. Uh, is it usually you chop them up super tiny. I think it might be slightly bigger Thank than usual. Yeah, I, 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 and it's have you, small. It's small. Have you tried right. this dish before, love? Uh, no, <laughs> fuck no. <laughs> well, you will save a cam for love. <laughs> I, I don't know what that did. Fuck. All right, I, I'm gonna try this one. I'm gonna. Try you know, this one. just to give it, in, put it into proportions. I have been at places where surströmming has been prepared maybe twice my whole life. Like this is not something you do. If you're below the age of 60. Yeah. Yeah, because it's like depression food. Why else would you <laughs> yeah. eat it? Yeah. All right, Zachy. Oh, fuck me. Oh. You don't like the look of that? I, th I thought this is the nicest looking one so far. Uh, the sour cream is, you know, I'm, I'm weird with yogurts the and cream. creams. You could scoop it off. I'd be fine mm. with that. The sour cream is going to save you, I think, here. Sour cream and the onion seems like it'll cover the yeah taste the most. Just pretend it's See, that's what, what I've been saying. I think literally the sour cream and the onions are made to just absorb any flavor. Right. Chocolate, mocha, colored cream. Colored cream. Yeah, all, all different, different flavors. flavors. All different flavors. Hey, you want me to go? Do it, bud. Let's see it. Give us a skull. 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 Oh, there we go. How do you say I love? It's like shears, so it's not accurate, but skull. Skull. Dip mm -hmm. some skull. Go. Skull. Back one bite. Oh, he's out. Into the tiny cup. My cup is killing me, oh, bud. How, uh, I love the, How's that cup smell, dude? <laughs> oh, God. 
That's even nastier than like a dip cup. You see when people spit? Yeah. 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 That's the worst thing. Ah! <laughs> now, was the problem the cream or the fish or everything? It was everything, man. It was the worst. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, did you like this one, Sam and Ian? Uh, I actually haven't tried this one. Oh, fuck okay, go perfect. Right Let's ahead, get him one. Friend. Let's get Ian one, please. <sighs> She didn't make this one till this morning, I think. Oh. Can we get Ian to try it? Do we have to do that? <laughs> Come here, Nui. Here, you can have half of mine. I'm not gonna eat the whole thing. We could cut it in half. Uh. Cause there's two dollops of sour cream, so that's uh. perfect for Ian. Uh. Here, I'll cut it in half. I'm so excited to do that. That was the worst, man. That was uh. the worst one? Uh. Shivers down my spine. Jesus. Perfect. Olivia, you're up? He's been subjected to this the is... Seuss Roman so many times. I'm sorry. I feel so bad. <laughs> well, he hasn't tried this one. Do so. we want me to... This is the worst one you said, Zach? I, well, I'm weird with, like, creams and shit. I think it's I think it's a Zach issue. Mm -hmm. so it's made a jar of mayonnaise. Okay. I'm right. That's fine. not it's not cream, technically. It's creamy. All right, here, give this to... a. Uh... Well, you gotta take yours. Give this I'll to go Ian. deliver that. <laughs> Yeah, give that. Right, Olivia's body. going for it. Yum. I'm not gonna carry it by hand. <laughs> give me the thing. Here we oh. go. Uh, okay. Skull. Skull. Are we ready? Yo! Dinks, bro. Just <laughs> smelled my finger. Huge mistake when eating Soon Strowman. Never <laughs> smell your finger. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. Olivia's going in. Stick your finger. Put it all in there. Chewing thoughtfully. She's. Gagging she's a little bit more this time than any way other time. Better than the previous. Oh, oh. oh she got almost, way further that almost, time yeah. though. Yeah. She did. Oh, so close. It's when the fish hits you, right? Your finger. Yeah. Ugh. Nasty. <laughs> Here's the thing: is I loved it. Besides the fact. That's all of these. They're all so good. Yeah. Girly. Damn, mm -hmm. you're incredibly talented. Literally, I'm so sorry. None of my <laughs> none of my reactions are a basis on your cooking. <laughs> You're right, amazing Ian. and fantastic, and I love you. This Ian. is very exciting. Ian is about to, uh... Hey, does Cam have one or no? I do. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I split mine with The people's champion, you. Cam. Uh, okay, go ahead. Yeah, and this guy's a king. Right. He's got it. Cam has got them all down. I think I just like to visit Sweden someday, so I'm really trying to choke it down, you know? <laughs> all right. Skull. Skull. Do it for Moomin. Skull. Moomin! Moomin! Do it for Moomin. Uh-oh. Cam is great. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is not a good one for Uh-oh. I just don't like the texture of the cracker. Crackers. Oh, the cracker's the problem. You okay. grimace for the cracker? Disgusting cracker. Oh, cracker. cracker. All around cracker. it's just weird textures. Cracker! Hmm. Oh, brother. I am not going to fare well Yeah, the with fish this. really starts to come through. He's getting it down, though. He's doing it. He's doing his job. He's having a hard time. This, this is a gross one. I will say, this is fucking gross. This, this is, is Cam's biggest challenge yet. In fact, wow. is he going to swallow it? He is going to swallow it. Yeah, I got it. It's gone. That was rough. It's that gone. Gross. I wouldn't expect it. This is the buff, the tough one, huh? All right, let's see what you got, Ian. The cracker is disgusting. Oh wait, Ian doesn't have a camera because that's what they're smoking. Just, yeah, actually, here I'll come over there. Oh good. Ian stepping in front of the camera. What a guy. <laughs> we'll do it together. Yeah. Okay. Like that is a funny idea. That is a funny idea, but no. No. Should we do yeah. that? Should we wrap scoot, our arms? Scoot a little over. Like, yours is bigger. You eat that one. Oh wait, no. We feed ourselves like this. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Okay. Ready? Three, two, one. School. Oh. School. <laughs> no. For fun. School. Come on. Come on. No. 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 Don't chew, do it. Chew. 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 Uh, you got chew this. It, you got it. this. You're a champion. Yeah. Come Skull on. Embarrassing. Oh my god. <laughs> you tried though. Oh. I, oh. I'm holding my breath, but then I know when you breathe, the fika hits you. Yeah. That one yep. is just straight fika, dude. Yeah. Hell fucking no. It's awful. Hell. You know. I was gonna say Swedish hate Sweden hates you now, but just one one percent of Sweden that eats just the boomers eats, just hates you now. Yeah. 
So you probably don't Fuck have to worry. That. Yeah. Is that it, Sam? That was. That's all. Shout that out, was Sam. That the last one. Oh. Very good. Very Thank good. you How very much, you Sam. Ladies and gentlemen. Well done. Well done, Sam. Course, they all looked uh, delicious. They, the presentation was amazing. Flavors were immaculate. No, you know, literally. Was, <laughs> the palette know. was so incredible. <laughs> <laughs> Ethan's still struggling back there. <laughs> oh. There's some mouthwash uh, in the bathroom, I believe. I'm yeah. Cloroxing everything around me. It's in my, yeah. I keep saying it's in my mustache. Like this. Oh. Yeah. Yikes. Yeah. yeah, that's going to linger. That's the yeah. worst part is you. you're going to be burping that for Oh, I already hours. am. Mm -hmm. I already am. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry to say. Ian, what did you think of the last one there? Ian, thoughts? Um, I, oh, my camera's not working. Um, it wasn't that bad, but it's, I'm having uh, flashbacks to the burping. And that's uh, what's throwing me off because I know it's definitely the worst part. I know it's going to stay with me. I got mouthwash. Wasn't that bad though? Yeah. I think what your advantage is because you had COVID V1. Here we go. You had that COVID one. Here come the accusations. I'm not. No, 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 no. I'm not bringing you down. You think I'm juicing? I'm not. I'm not bringing I'm not you here down. Juicing. I'm not bringing you down by any means. I'm just saying it might have tainted. You know, the, that COVID one. You're calling me. You think I'm like the Barry Bonds of uh, the Barry Bonds of, of Pika Fish. I think it's just you. The Hunger FF. The Lance Long Armstrong. Of well, no, the Hunger fish. FF is the Barry Bonds of butthole. Um, mm. You're like the. Uh, this man's on three rounds of COVID. Fair foul play. <laughs> foul play. <laughs> you're juicing like Mark McGuire. Yeah. <laughs> what do you want me to play? Dan, Dan's over my shoulder asking me to press this. I did not ask. What? Why do you want me to press that? Different perspectives. To see your input. Oh. Kind of weird. Now, put that phone down. <laughs> Wait. Just in time for Father's Day. Right there. No, no. You're good. Oh, just black. Different screen. perspectives. Oh. Yeah. Don't need to be switching to any of this. You want this back? No. <laughs> weird. We're out of mouthwash. Weird. Well. Oh. Uh, this I is. Wash uh, that mouth manually. I gave him some toothpaste to stick on his finger. Oh. Ow. Like a kid at a sleepover. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to go home. That was literally me. My parents picked me up from sleepaway camp. Me too. Really? I hated sleepovers. Yeah, I went to a sleepover once and uh -huh. um, I pretended to have an uh, upset stomach. Me all the time. Look. Really? Hey. Well, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Got you. I used to ask to stay a little longer and be like, maybe could I stay a couple days? Yeah. Maybe the whole weekend. For a sleepover or a sleepaway camp? Sleepover. I always wanted to go to sleepaway camp. Never could. What the hell is sleepaway camp? That's what Olivia was talking about, right? Yeah. Oh, I was in the bathroom, sorry. Like summer camp. Oh, okay. I was a counselor at camp. Not sleep away, but it was like a day camp. You were a counselor? Mm -hmm. Were you one of the creepy I was ones? You were a narc. Uh, oh. day camp. I taught, uh, oh, my, my activity was uh, movie magic. Oh. <laughs> what? Yeah. Wait, what does that mean? <laughs> it was just like the movie portion. So like, I'd have the kids make like storyboards or um, just like. Just they a would, camp like, counselor recording a bunch of kids. What's weird about that, Dan? <laughs> Why do you got to make everything so perfect? <laughs> oh, Actually, I got to make everything so perfect. I remember. I wonder if I could find it. The sleepaway camp that my parents picked me up from the day after I got there. I, I did the rock star, the rock star portion of the camp. You got to like choose your medium, I guess. And they were like, I was crying the whole day. They knew that I was leaving after like that day. So the counselors were like, Olivia, why don't you like get in and why don't you sing your song? Like you can record it so that we can have it on the CD that we like burn at the end of camp. And um, I was just sobbing, crying all day. They were trying to get me to drink water. I refused to drink water. And there's a <laughs> recording of me singing on top of a karaoke track to Do You Believe in Magic? And I'm crying the whole time I'm singing it. And you <laughs> can tell because sometimes I'll take like a breath and I'll be like, <laughs> and it is, I need to find it. I yeah, hope, I was going to oh. say, you might need to show, show this on the show. Yeah, bro. My sister came in clutch when I was there. Love you, Al. Yeah, she she was like, no, 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 you don't understand. She needs to call my mom. She needs to go home. <laughs> uh, Ethan is still like puking or something. I, I, I just hear the water there. running a bunch. I think he just oh. got his mouth under the <laughs> fountain. Huh? 
Get some jams going. Jam music. Kick out the jams. Ian's Get some jams. Go jam, jam music. Okay. Do you believe in magic? <laughs> yeah. Do you believe in magic? I think Ali yeah. and AJ had just dropped a cover of that. I was channeling them. Yeah, you know, let's change it up a little. Mm. Oh, yo, Mr. Breast. Yo, I know him. <laughs> My favorite YouTuber, Mr. Breast. We're blasting Hello, off. Ethan. Oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Look like a blood splatter fucking CSI scene. What happened? Yeah. yeah. What happened? <laughs> I ran to the bathroom in a panic and started throwing water in my mouth. And then did someone finish the the mouthwash just now? Not me. Hmm. I could use some. I got edge up if anybody wants that. Wash Ed it down with some edge up. Okay, that last one was was vile. Did you even try to mask it, or is that just straight fika? No, that's the Swedish that way. The... I just I did it exactly. So, the, so that's straight out of the can. Yeah. Oh well, oh. no fucking wonder it was so no, wild. That's Hilarious. the classic way to serve it. That yeah. that is the that's mm. the way the Swedes do it. And I thought the they like boiled I it and didn't shit. Didn't just take one bite of. That's no. the one that I went. No. Nope. The, the burps are so bad. Ian. <clears throat> the cooking process is being in salt for like a half a year. The burps are awful. Mm. I just had the rice cake one, but I keep burping it up. Yeah, so the last one, I held my breath, didn't taste anything. Okay. The texture I'm chewing, it's fine. But I know the minute that I breathe, it's going to hit me like a, like want, a tsunami. Do you want a soda as a that. chaser? Want a that, soda? That's probably a good idea. You want a soda? <laughs> On it. Cam's got it. Yeah. Oh, Cam's feeling you. bad for me, I guess. Oh, thank you. That's quick. That was quick, Olivia. <laughs> yep. Thank you, AB. Following, <coughs> um, following in our footsteps. That last one was the worst one. Although I didn't try the squishy, nasty one. I knew that one was going to... I was going to puke if I did yeah. that one. <laughs> How'd you like it, Ian? You weren't even phased by that shit. Like I said, it wasn't too bad, but... Um, I just know th what will happen later. Mm. Ian loves my cooking. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you raw dog the whole fish, so. I was struggling last night, though, when she was in the test kitchen. Find the roast of the raw. It, it is so big of both of you to give up your apartment to the smell of fika fish. It was a treat for our cats. They oh, loved the, the cat smell. Really loved it. We didn't oh feed them God, the fish, they were in but uh, the smell alone was like sensory overload. Yeah. <laughs> Here's what we're doing. Love, you're moving here. Uh, yeah. We have a can of fika, and we're gonna fuck your whole life up when we get here. I already tried to eat it though, and I was punished so badly. I got fucking juice all over my. Oh, room. that's right. But yeah, you, you guys. He you opened guys are, like, it in his room. That. Yeah. Oh I, yeah, that was awesome. I feel like I've already done my part. No. I. No. 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 You gotta okay, do the hot dude. chip. I'm. I'm just. I'm become like racist against Swedes. That's not right. That's not right <laughs> at all. So I got to put you through <clears throat> Swedish fika torture. No, I did my part, dude. Well, sure. Fika filet? Filet of fika? <laughs> no. All right, let's move on. Let's just forget that this ever happened, please. Good job, you Sam, though. Me. Well done. Thank Presentation you. was amazing. And uh, what can I say? You're, you're, you're great. Thanks. Can we go home now? Uh, no, no, Zach, you gotta wait till the show's over. I mean, you could go home if you're actually sick. Oh, it's burps. I don't know what to do. We got Tums? <laughs> um, I think so. I can uh, give you some. I would love some Tums. I'm trying to breathe the flavor off Dude, my Dude, I'm tongue. done. I'm done with Fika shit. Thank God. I'm not doing, I'm not eating any more of that. I'll make other people eat it, but I'm not. You know, I only used one can. We have two more cans. You hear that, love? Two more cans. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve this. Hey, bro, do it or or else I'm gonna send your ass back to Sweden. <laughs> well, well, shit. Well, uh, if you guys do something creative with it, I'll, I'll try it. Of course. I'm just yeah. kidding. I won't. Anything I won't for force. The show. I won't force you to do it. No, no, I'll do it. Ugh. Oh, 
let's move on. Here's a dude driving into a shopping mall crying. Love that. Go, King. Cal <laughs> <Cal> cleanser. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of the way, man. He's trying to come through here. Excuse me. Dude, there's a little... God damn, bro. Come through. Any iPhones available? So, okay, first of all, I didn't like seeing that kid have to run. That Everyone is okay? Everyone's okay. Everyone's great. Okay, because that would have been really fucked. But other than that, I think this person thought their car was going to explode or something when they hit the mall. You know, they only hit it going like five miles per hour. It's kind of like a cr leisurely cruise through the mall. <laughs> Is there a story? Do we have any background on we this? Try to look into uh, it. Yeah. <laughs> Olivia found one article, but it wasn't English. It was in, in Chinese, mm. and I had to translate it, and it was pretty short. But the thing on Reddit said that a guy's girlfriend broke up with him. The actual article that I read said that it was during COVID. Someone had lost their job, and, and he, this was potentially the result of that. I think he just wanted to change his cell phone plan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he just give had guy, some errands give the to guy run. a break. Yeah. You ever been, you never been in a rush? I have, Jesus. actually. I get it. That's he was late Are to work. I do sound that way. Ah! <laughs> when I'm late to That's work. That's how I drive every morning. <laughs> yeah, well, here's a good driver, unlike that last one. This guy knows how to park a car. <laughs> And that's what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> Some Ace Ventura shit. <laughs> <laughs> like a glove. <laughs> yeah. They, yeah. <laughs> that dude's about to go buy some groceries right now. <laughs> dude, that's the best. It's hard to find a spot. We're being really judging <laughs> of these drivers. Jeez. That was fucking amazing. <laughs> He's like, all right, I'll be right back, sweetheart. <laughs> I'm going to go grab some things. <laughs> You want anything from the store? <laughs> 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 this is fucking awesome. Oh, yeah, man. That's good. That's some good shit right <laughs> there, brother. Tell you what. Ethan, the, you want some Tums? It definitely helps. No, I didn't swallow any, so I'm not having any of the crazy burps. Oh, man. I just need to get... How are you doing? You okay? I'm fine, yeah. It's just the burps are just... It's just the taste... Revisited just a little rice cake Could The pick. rice cake was hard just it was very stale because I imagine she cooked it yesterday Well, no, it was supposed to be crispy like fried. No, I know that but it was Meaty. They, oh, okay. I see what you're saying. Yeah You want to do this? Uh, I would love to do the PowerPoint uh, What if, it'll take like 30 minutes. Is that okay? 30 minutes? How long we been going down? Uh, we're going on three Oh, you hours. know what? Let's save it. Because I want to do the... It's Bryce. This guy's my oh, yeah. fave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ela might get a kick out of it, too. So. Okay. So this guy, I found him on my, like, Instagram Reels page. And I was like, yo, this is fucking crazy. Bryce Savage. He's 33 years old. And... I'm not necessarily making fun of him because, you know, anyone who's out there living her, their passion, I think, is uh, admirable. Right? But what I will say is I am not laughing. So here, I'll just give you a little taste. Of a banger. Is it always the shortest girls that have the biggest attitudes? She's 5'5 five five with a little attitude. She likes guys. She likes some girls too. Dark eyes and her hair matches her mood. She's my type, never will forget the view. Is this what real love feels like? Ooh. I hear a song from that night. Mm. Alright, is it
it just me or is it always so, so my favorite is just me is my favorite is the way he starts them <laughs> the whole thing to me i was just caught off guard by like the way he's dressed the way he's looked he's a little bit too old to be participating in this kind of thing but he's stinking his dream it's the uh, sh sleeveless aerosmith shirt for me Mm, right, wow. but that's and, and it is the it's like the mix of like this classic rock and roll mm -hmm. thing mixed with like the li And again, I'm not trying to make fun of Bryce, but this shit sucks <laughs> he's, like, he's, like, he's like Axl it's, Rose if he was it's an It's like e the lamest fucking music I've ever heard. It's his deep side part I that thought it was I insightful. get a kick out of. Mm -hmm. You haven't never noticed? <laughs> the circles have the biggest attitudes? It's just him. He's like a Batman Begins version of Bret Michaels, I think <laughs> five 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 <laughs> the best part is the introductions he does is it always the shortest girls that have the biggest attitudes she's five five, five. five. and then and then he literally <laughs> says what he said he he literally sings That's what he good. said i like that he included the emoji there too god damn it how am i supposed to watch these if every time i open it it's automatically muted and then oh i can my. never watch the beginning yeah, Instagram's player sucks. Shortest girls that have the biggest attitudes. She's five, five <laughs> with a little attitude. That, that's what you just said. He has Literal. more little literal got, ones, yeah. He got well, more specific. He needs to get his thesis across. You said short Don't girls, you know? yeah, but we, yeah. Five five's not what, that short. What, yeah, what did he mean by that? Yeah. Well, he's saying five five. For a girl? Five five's not that short. That short. Yeah, I get, I, yeah, it's like average. Yeah. Average. Just me. Five two the shortest girls that have the biggest attitudes. She's five five with a little attitude. She's I guess five two five. would have sounded better. She's five two with a little attitude. Yeah. Five five yeah. is like average. But Four it, nine? But, but he's saying <laughs> she's three nine with a five, little three, attitude. <laughs> but he's saying that if you're five five, you have a little attitude. Oh, interesting. So that's average. So you're five see. two and you've got a big attitude. No. No. Mm. No, he's not saying that. Yeah, that's what he says. He says She's got a little attitude. Like, she's got a little attitude. But not the biggest part. attitude. No, but... Right. True. Which is what five... He, he but, starts it off not. by saying that... So, so, according to your theory, then, he's going to say... He's going to have another verse about a and short girl with a big girl. attitude? The big attitude. I mean, yeah, maybe on the bridge. <laughs> she's three nine. <laughs> she's a little attitude. <laughs> Every verse is a different height. <laughs> she's three nine, and she's like Osama Bin Laden. The shorter, the fucked up they are. Is it always the shortest girls that have the biggest attitudes? She's five five with a little attitude. She likes guys, but she likes some girls too. Her eyes and her hair matches her mood. Yo. She's my type, never will forget the view. Yo. Is this what real love feels like? Nope. I hear a song from that Yo. Alright, is it? Alright. So different versions of explaining the same song. Here, I just sent another one that's the same song. Oh, with a different oh, intro? Oh, he goes into more detail. Oh, fire. Okay. Or I gotta, I gotta be quick on that. this one. Unmute button. I gotta be the fastest unmute button in the The game. girl that's this tall, but she's got an attitude about this tall. Check this out. She's 5'5 five five with a little attitude. What? She likes guys, but she likes some girls too. Right. Oh, I like this version better. I was hoping for more details, but it he can a you less a deeper this, yeah, uh, a little less information of anything. Use a size nine shoe. <laughs> <laughs> Man hands in her <laughs> acrylic <laughs> shoe. Her nail polish is sparkle too. <laughs> is this what little girls are like? Oh no. <laughs> Proven oh, no. by High school. <laughs> I hate little women. They're such flames. Yeah. Fat guy with the fat attitude. <laughs> <laughs> he hates sugar. Wait. Oh, no. <laughs> fat guy with the fat attitude. He hates guys, but his fat is like a prude, like a Jew. <laughs> Yo, that beat's fire. That's literally his beat. Here we go. Great hair! Why, did you ever notice that the fattest guys have the bombest hairlines? <laughs> Fat 
guy with the great hairline. Hair He's shoot. fatter, but his hairline gets better. Fat guy, even fatter attitude. It's hard on the fly, you know. This guy obviously invested a lot of time in lyrics. <laughs> Let's, he's got a whole bunch of them, though. Let's see. So that one's pretty good. This is the original video I sent. This is the one that blew my ass out. Looking face, but... This one's fucking great. It's like they all have the same premise, too. Girl with a really innocent looking face, but whenever she opens her mouth, it's always like a dirty joke or thought coming out. Yeah, dude. We'll check this out. Yo. She got that innocent face, but a dirty little <laughs> That's just what you said. Um. <laughs> Every, all, of him, all of his songs are... She's this, but she's that. <laughs> like the first line is always the same. It's awesome. <laughs> he's the best, isn't he? I love that he's following his dreams. I want to jam with him, man. Yeah. You guys are on dream the collab. Girl with a really innocent looking face, but whenever she opens her mouth, it's always like a dirty joke. Or th I just I imagine this guy who's thirty three, trying to ma pick up like eighteen year olds for sure. <laughs> he's like, "Yo, babe." Are you into like alternative music? Well, then check this out. Have you ever met a girl who's got like big old titties but a tiny little heart? She's got big tits but a tiny little heart. Mommy She's no. bigger. <laughs> Her titties juggle like a bull. Star. My heart is ticking when I fall. She's such a bitch. But she's got giant tears. <laughs> Those beats are so on point. We'll check this out. Check this out. She got that innocent face, but a dirty little mind. A body like Melody's kind of cool on this one. She'll take over your life without warning. Got you addicted to the high in the morning. Long legs and she tastes so fine. Gross. Have you ever met a girl? Every a every fucking song is the same. I'll sh <laughs> they're all the same. It's so it's so cool. All right, well, to play devil's advocate here, and for his sake, couldn't you argue that every song in the '80s was the same too? Same premise, same plot, same style. I don't know. I'm not a musicographer. What type of music are you? Like talking hair about? metal. Yeah, specifically. that's awful too. Th th my point. Yeah, you know. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's like the first line is she's this, but she's that, which is contradiction. So this is the story of a girl yeah. making memories. No way. Two shots and she feels so pretty. Four shots and she'll run this city. Six shots and we might get busy. Yo. It's good times anytime she's with me. Eight shots, I'll be holding a handbag. Should it never break and do the over black? It's memory. Oh damn, the Uber Black? Yo, this guy balls hard. He just flexed with the Uber Black. <laughs> he definitely has three stars on Uber, too. <laughs> and how shots, I'm gonna catch a case. <laughs> uh, Pre-gaming. That's a very creepy story. Yes. Mm. Eight going. shots and I'm holding her hair back. Ten shots, I'm getting it out the rope. Twelve shots, I'm opening the basement cellar door. 14 shots, I've got her on the radiator. 16 shots, her mom is calling me, asking me if I know where she is. 18 Jeffrey shots. Jeffrey Dahmer, <laughs> Jeffrey Dahmer. 18 shots and the police come to my house. 20 shots, I tell them I don't know where she is. 22 shots, they say you're the last person that saw her. 24 shots, I said don't go in the basement. Woo! Fire. He's cool though. I, I, I don't want to give him too much shit. Sometimes he tells a story beforehand. He does a little skit instead of just a little intro. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. 5C is one it, of them. This one's her villain era. Alright, so this right here is for any girl that's just had enough. Bro, write a song about a dude, man. You know? Why do the girls get all those songs? It's for any girl that's just had enough and yeah, is what ready about, like, to a enter good her day. villain era. Yeah. That's it. 
Oh my she's God. just had a really bad day and she's oh ready to become a villain. She's a bad day and she's ready to be a villain. Yes. Alright, so yo. <laughs> Look, I'll give it to this guy. He's trying. He, he, he has know, a good voice. He's yeah. Trying. He, he's trying. He's putting himself out there. He's That's sure what I'm saying. Trial. Yeah. I, he, 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 you got to take risks. And he's right. Why is it the shorter scrolls have the biggest attitude? That's what that. I'm trying to say. <laughs> I have noticed that. This one's I've I'd, been saying that. Yeah. No, I know. You do always say that. It's nice yeah. that someone backs you up finally. I'd do anything to be with her. She's a sad girl. Uh oh. She's a sad girl. Wait. With the what is this song about? I'm so, <laughs> oh, this is right. I what? know. He didn't. I'm I know. lost. I know. I know. It's she's sad, but she's pretty. Why didn't no, he, no. Why I thought sad? it was a happy girl who's not photogenic. Yeah. Wait. Oh shit. See, why he should have done he, the intro. He needs to be more clear. Yeah. Okay, Bryce. I just want to know how fucking tall she is. Yeah. yeah. Like how big or small is her <laughs> attitude? Yeah. Is she a bad chick? Like on a height scale, is she a 5'6", is she a 5'8 attitude, is she a 5'11 attitude? Right. <laughs> Look at, there, here's the top comment. Could you do a song about a girl who's scared to be herself because of her past? Mmm, that's a good because one. Because of her P-A-S-S-E-D. <laughs> because past. of her past. <laughs> it's a scared girl who's afraid of her, her past. <laughs> <laughs> She's a sad girl with the prettiest pictures. All the fall that she's carrying with her sad world. With the past sad world. world. <laughs> it is a sad world. She's pretty in pink and she's pretty in black. I can't think what she looks like. That's really sweet. With pretty pictures. So she looks good in pictures, but she's beat in real life. <laughs> no, he said she looks pretty in pink and she looks pretty in black. Which I think is kind and nice and a sweet. But why does he say he's? Why does he say she's a sad girl? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We got that. Yeah. But then she's pretty in pictures. Like he makes that he makes that distinction right. that only in pictures Normally does she, she look that. pretty. Well, the <laughs> like is did the he get catfished? She's a sad girl, but she looks pretty in pictures. Supposed to be like, but she looks happy in photos, or is he just saying she's sad but she's hot? That he's trying to say she's had she's sad but she's hot, but I think it even mm -hmm. goes deeper. She's sad. I sad. thought she was hot, but then when I met up with her, she wasn't hot. She only looks sad. good in pictures. So she's and actually black. so she's sad and ugly. Right. Which, as you know. Is the worst. Right. <laughs> <laughs> if you're gonna be sad, you might as well be hot about it. So true. <laughs> I do anything to be with her. Anything, bro? She's a sad girl with the prettiest pick. It's just it's pretty interesting. You know. And again, great guy. Love him. I sent an Love example the hustle of uh, the storyline ones. Okay, thank you. Here we got a whole story. This is what I- the more talking the better, in my opinion. That's why I'm here. She's a sad girl! <laughs> yeah, let's crush it, dude. Alright, I'm gonna get the session set up. Bro, oh. my girl just dumped me over text. No way. Wait, what? She said I play too many video games and that I'll never be a real musician. Yo. Oh, that's Didn't you guys date for like two years? Yep. Dude, I am sorry. Maybe you should yeah. just take the day off. Hell no. Nah. Hit record. I got something I gotta say. I got yeah. you. Yeah. So f you, you broke my heart into. Damn, and you now know. I hate everything, everyone. He already knows the words. Is this based on a true story, you think? Yeah, yeah. Yes, the brothers. Every rose has its thorn. I think he's a virgin. I think he's 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 an incel. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah he's, with he's definitely in so. Oh, a, I vibe with a little attitude. <laughs> oh, I'm literally never gonna stop. Penetration. And now I hate everything, everyone, and everything. everything. Yeah, yeah. I hate you. Yeah, I mean, he's I he's, he's really versatile. I love him playing the role of someone listening to his music and loving it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's awesome. He plays that role really, that's like, really well. That's like when Fresh and Fit hit their own sound bites. Mm -hmm. It was cool when when the producer character that he's playing knew the lyrics of the song that mm -hmm. he was <laughs> probably singing was already singing along. 
I sent uh, one about anxiety. A girl with anxiety. Okay, that is relatable. Yeah. I like that. Thank you. I hope he says that. He does. Is that how you figured that out? Nah. You have to read between the lines. What? <laughs> Subtext. Yeah. I'm a girl whose mind races at night, playing a constant loop of everything that causes her anxiety. Uh oh. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Bro, can you? Why is it going to be about a girl? It's what every. Again, parallel with the 80s music. No, oh, stop it. Dude, come on. <laughs> let, let her out. You're talking about yourself, man. Just let her out. Oh, interesting. Loop of everything that causes her yeah. anxiety. Oh. Yeah, he's talking about himself. Fucking goddamn. Races at God. night, playing a constant loop of everything that causes her anxiety. So interesting. Right. You're so right. Yeah. I feel like it'd be, his music would be a lot more personal if he just yeah. said, you know, when you're laying in bed and your thoughts are racing it's at just, night. Yeah, right. it's about him. Yeah. Why, why you got to project it all into some girl that's, you know, never going to fuck you anyway. And maybe even sleeping soundly. Who knows? Mm-hmm. Mm hmm. Can we peep the hashtags real quick? Hashtag sad song. Hashtag sad. Hashtag mental health. Hashtag mental health awareness. Hashtag poetry. Hashtag sad poetry. poetry. Yeah. Hashtag sad lyrics. Hashtag alternative. <laughs> hashtag emo. Okay. I know we're all uh, searching up hashtag sad lyrics on Instagram. All the time. Yeah. This is a song about hashtags. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, props. I mean, this, this has 100,000 likes, so he's balling. Oh, she's lying in bed. Okay, let's start using hashtags. And she Wow. So this is the story of a girl whose mind races at night, playing a constant. He has loop a very clear voice. I will say. He's a hunk. I'd fuck him. <laughs> no, he fucks. <laughs> <laughs> but he gives me the vibe of like you think he does, but his game is so bad he just creeps and weirds out every girl mm. and repels them. That's what I'm getting. He definitely brings up his music in every conversation, for sure. Dude, I don't think women like him. I think he's, yeah. I think he's a repellent. I've met dudes like him. Uh, of course, I don't know anything about you, though. You're the best. <laughs> I mean, you're the best, dude. Really so this is the story of a girl where everyone's first impression of her is that she's really innocent. Didn't we already hear this one? <laughs> when you get to actually talk to her, you find out she's kind of got a dirty mind. She got yeah, that did. Oh, okay. It's a different intro, though. Mm. Oh, right. I remember when he set this one up. <laughs> yeah, he's the man. I like him. I don't know. I'm not trying to be a hater. <laughs> it just it just really blew me away when I saw it. Here, if Putin starts World War III. If Putin starts World War III, this is going to be my theme song. <laughs> Putin got a dirty little mind. No. You guys are going to die, too. Why is he the only Wait, one yeah. that lives? Fine? What do you know? Well, there you go. That's not, a song's not about a girl. It's about yeah, there you go. It is. It's about if you everybody dies, it's me and you alive. Mm. Oh. It's still about a girl. He's so I just want to know how they were able to survive. Because we died. We need a... We need I'd another. Like to know. Well, maybe it's in the second verse. Putin starts World War Three. This is going to be my theme song. If everybody died, leave it me. Okay. It's giving oh. Patrice Wilson. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wasn't Sorry, sure what bro. he said there, but he spelled it. <laughs> it is giving me Patrice Wilson's verse on Friday. Yeah. Okay. We love him. Just something that came up. She got that. She got that innocent Oh, this is his bot. This is his big, That's big my banger. favorite one. Yeah, I'll be honest. This is his banger. That's his <laughs> signature tune. Girls that have the biggest attitudes. She's five, five with I, I, my favorite is when he says literally <laughs> the exact thing <laughs> he <laughs> set it up with. It's so cool. So there it is. Uh, he, but he's doing good. Good for him. He's doing great. Yeah, he's doing good. Doing he's on things. TikTok too. His Spotify number. He's got like over six hundred thousand followers on. There you Spotify. go, Bryce Savage. Oh my god. Okay. He's on if TikTok. you're a single mom, I want you to stop one scrolling for, five, for one Yo, second. we got one for the mom. single mom. Shout out to the single Let's mom. Go. Right there. Let's so go. So my wife was a single mother before we met. Obviously, she isn't anymore. Oh, he's my married. He's married. Married. Oh. And actually... Take it all and, back. You were calling him an incel. I take it all back. A woman repellent. Take it all back. His wife also has, sounds like has a child from another marriage. So that's a huge thing for him, uh, stepping up like that. So good for him. He's a good man. Yeah. Bryce is a good man.
What if a guy. If you're a single mom, I want you to stop scrolling tall for one second wife and hear me out. She's 5'5". Five, five. Oh, no, she's really tall. Really? Oh, <laughs> yeah, right. you wouldn't marry She's 6'5", like, and she's got the coolest no attitude. <laughs> <laughs> so my wife was a single mother before we met. Obviously, she isn't anymore. But for Mother's Day, I wrote her. You something. like how he bounces? Like, look how he's bouncing his feet. Yeah. So my wife was a single mother before we met. He's got Obviously, anxiety. She isn't Why is he bouncing? For Mother's Day, I wrote her something that has a message that Aww. is not only for her, but for any single mom that's out there working hard to make ends meet. Okay. So I posted a snippet of this message in a song, and a ton of people used it as a sound over the weekend and just shared it and really resonated with the message. So this one goes out to my wife in the past when she was struggling. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed Mother's Day and keep raising good people because the world needs them. Okay. okay. Single mom. You think, um, first half of that video was touching, <laughs> not <Beautiful>. the second half. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think his wife likes his music? Yes. Yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah I'm kidding. She's she, probably supportive. She's number one fan. She doesn't give him any lips. Yeah, she, okay. yeah. she is like well over six. She's like seven two. She is the <laughs> chillest woman she's you the have ever met. <laughs> she's she the tallest no woman that ever lived. I disagree. She's five five and she fucking hates it. <laughs> Wait. Okay, okay. Oh, that's different. <laughs> Attitude, I, she's got a yeah. lot of things. I'm telling you. <laughs> this one's about him being a Pisces, dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, she oh, no, like she's a Pisces. She's loved like a Pisces. She might be wife, be a little bit Pisces. <laughs> These songs that have the same chord progression just shift to a different key. Dude, they're all the fucking same song. He's like dressed the same. The song is the same. The f it's cr it's wild. It's just like it's incredible. This genre. He's that branded he's himself. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. When yes. I hear a Bryce Savage, I know it's a Bryce Savage. Hundred percent. Yeah, I only date Pisces. Whatever that means. I'm a Pisces, just saying. I knew mm. it. I knew you. I had a feeling, brother. Me and you. She's a sad girl with the prettiest pictures. All right. Uh, so that's it. So thank you, Bryce. Uh, we do love you. Shut up, Bryce. Woo! Oh, we have a picture of him and his wife. Is this from social media? I can show this. Yeah, social media. Instagram. Is from it weird Graham. to pull this up or fine? I mean, they look happy. Not like in a bad way. What does that mean in a bad? No, I said it's happy? not in a bad way. They're just happy. It's at their at their wedding. They oh. just look happy. Well, yeah, I mean it's. A yeah, he's a he's a he's a public figure. I think it's yeah. relevant because he's. Yeah, they look happy. Age. And she looks his Aww. age, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, age appropriate. Very cute. Love them. I love that he wrote her a beautiful song for Mother's Day. <laughs> Me too. That is very. That's nice. Look, she. Yeah. You know, it's kind of hard to tell, but. He looks fairly tall, like <laughs> right. Off in height Ooh, from him. and she's in flash. She's too. bending right. her feet, probably. Yeah, she's kind of, yeah, she's kind of bent slightly. So. so she sometimes the women do that in the picture because they don't want to dominate their man. Right. So she's kind of making herself shorter for his benefit. Because he's got, she's got no attitude about it. Does that mean he's a, a dick? Tall, she's a tall queen. Or is that only applicable to women? What? Is he a dick because he's short? Does he have a no, big attitude? Yeah. I'm gonna judge, five, we five. judge men on their height around here. I'm like, he's five. little and he has a little dick. Don't we don't no, big we don't talk about big our boy dick. Bryce like Stop that. It. I was uh -huh. that wasn't about him. No, that was about the royal him. <laughs> uh, the royal he. So then there's other ones actually, because I was like, is this this is a whole genre apparently? I don't know what kind of music you call this, but there's another guy who's crushing it. X to official. And I'll say, this guy, in my opinion, X, 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 Tassion. <laughs> this guy gets more of a pass from me just because he's younger. Mm. He's like 23 or 22. 22. We're not sure exactly, but that's what we saw on Google. So, but, but he's definitely on the train of, uh, 
what are we dubbing this genre? Um, emo, holy, emo, emo trap. TikTok artists that explain their lyrics in great detail. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. E boy. So here he is. This guy's got it. Before you listen to sad songs to feel happy, and all of your favorite singers are mentally ill and scream in pain, here's your daily dose of serotonin. Just moved to LA down to our spare chain. So, so I like that he explains it more. Mm hmm. Right. She broke up. Stuck here, home so far away. Yeah. Bro, I can't, I can't, I'm not even gonna joke on this. He's 22. He's out there crushing it, you know what I mean? I mean, the other dude's 33. <laughs> Which is, you know, it's like kids bop. You can't kids bop at 33. Kids bop. <laughs> no, this one, I'm not gonna lie, we were jamming out to him. Number yeah. three specifically, we, we were singing all morning. Lyrics start with, I'm a 5'4 man whore. Uh oh. This one's my favorite. You're oh, even yeah. shorter than his short girl. I wonder if he is actually 4'4". 5'4". Four, four. I'm 4'4". 5'4", four, four. Four. sorry, sorry. I'm a 5'4 man whore who sled heads rest Yet a hundred thousand kids Yo! I just wasn't expecting that line. Very important, important to the genre to say heights. You probably be into bro, it, Ethan. Bro, I'm not even gonna hate this. This is better than the last guys, <laughs> without a doubt. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. better than the last guys. Oh, this fucks. And he's younger. Five, four, man, whore. I don't like that he flexes how many kids like him though. I don't like that he flexed that he tried to kill himself. <laughs> Seems like a flex. Like this move. It's like dope. <laughs> it's not cool. It's Whoa. not like it's not dope. Like that's not like cool. It's emo though. So that's TX2 official who um uh, people like despite him cutting his wrists. Well, he he uses hashtag emo. Oh, we that. need to start all those tagging all of our videos. Ones. Hashtag emo. Hashtag mentally ill. <laughs> and maybe his art is his way of healing. Who, who's to say? Right, and people can find, like, I'm a former emo kid. You can find catharsis through seeing other people share your suffering and stuff. But mm -hmm. as an adult, Definitely. this is very goofy. Five, four, I got no problem with this dude. Four. This guy's crushing it. I got, this guy's the man, okay? Now, just imagine he's making the same music <laughs> in 11 years. You gotta, there's a certain point where you mm. need to evolve a little bit as an artist. Right. But I'm feeling, I'm feeling TX2 official. Just don't glorify self abuse. Like, that's self not a good thing. You know, don't. Yeah, that's mm. not. Lay I, off that stuff. I wasn't feeling that too much. But a bullet and a kid's head think they got a sickness and they're not dressed up. Bro, are you doing it again? Let's go. Wait, what is? Put a bullet in that kid's head. Uh, let me. I'm straight. But what happens in the closet doesn't matter if you pop it from the flag of the USA. You do is your job. You base your life off the nation strong. <laughs> oh, that's kind of based. Okay, kind of based, actually. Yeah. I'm very fucking, based. Yo, this is the Gen Z that we need taking over. You just called out all these closeted. Dude, this is a vibe, Dan. This is a vibe. That was good. Kids said think they got a sickness and they're not dressed. Right. That's actually kind of poignant. That's it's kind of poignant. Speaking to you, huh? That is kind of hitting. Yeah. He's right. My boy's got a point. Mm -hmm. If you okay. you can see the <laughs> white text or the uh, black text with white background there gives more context too. Like go to the start of the video again. Okay. USA, you're too old. Yep. You do is your job. Yeah. Fuck religion. Mm -hmm. So, which part were you talking uh, about? Let, her, let her play. Look at. This is a message to the governor. Oh man, you spell you misspelled governor like really He's bad. He's trying. He's trying. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Governors. <laughs> Governors. Wait, hold the phone, brother. His best. Man. This heart's I, in the right place. Okay. Listen, I'm not a great speller, but I haven't smelled governors that bad since I was in like third grade. This is a message to the governors. <laughs> Who are banning drag shows in public spaces and access to healthcare for anyone trans under 18. I'm with you, brother. Absolutely. Not 
named this song Randy McNally after the governor, Governor. <laughs> is he doing that on purpose? I was curious if he thinks it's going to be suppressed if he writes governor. Why would he be suppressed for writing governor? I don't know, but he has other things. Changed the uh, writing of some other things. Governor? He did it twice. Mm -hmm. I can't see any reason to do that other than misspelling it. Well, he misspelled Tennessee, too. <laughs> Touche. <laughs> oh, fuck, bro. Hearts in the right place. <laughs> Proper spelling is for fucking boomers. Yeah. You know what? The lyrics are good. I like it. You're too fucking old. You too is your job. He says, go watch it in my profile. Okay. He, so he does have some interesting styles. He does profile with a one for the eye. But if you have, Dude, what do you think? This is 2003 is so back. We are so back, baby. I'm, Bring back MySpace and get it over with. Dude, I'm feeling <laughs> TX too. <laughs> well, that's a We have multiple music videos for this one. Okay, but there it is. Uh, but then we go back uh, to the originator. I was trying to think, like, who's the king of this genre? Is it Bryce? Because Bryce has the most following so far. But then you go back all the way. And you find this dude. Uh, where's that dude? Oh, here. Social Repos. Now, I don't know anything about this guy. Other than he was dating Trisha's sister when I was in their life. And I was like. Interesting life choice. I mean, no offense. No. He takes that 5%. <laughs> I mean, you know. So. <laughs> so, uh, so check this guy out. I guess a lot of people know who he is. I'm not super familiar, but he's he's got a wild outfit he gets down in. Um, here he is on a park bench. <laughs> Wait, he dropped a song with the N-word in it, which is pretty hardcore. No, that's not him. That's a no. oh, different guy. Oh, it's here. Oh, okay. I'm my bad, Social Repos. I'm talking about someone else. Uh, he has not dropped a song with the N-word. But where's a video here? I want to see him rock out. I sent in Discord. <laughs> Ethan, can we... <laughs> Are you going to watch the video? Uh, where is it? It was sent in Discord. God damn. Get that. Here. This man straight up owns that bench. Telephone for mine. There was <laughs> your heart on the line. I really fucked it up. Deny my dear. Deny my dear. <laughs> gotta say, he's got a voice on him. I can't tell. The fucking sounds... auto tune is yeah. like. Are you sure? It's, smoking. It's on it? it, oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I can't tell. It sounds like it's studio recorded, which yeah, is impossible. No, I think he's lip syncing too. Yeah. And those yeah. are fake water sound effects. Yeah. yeah, so, so, then, yeah, it's not even the original audio. It looks, it, you could tell, the sound just is on, doesn't feel right. Is that him singing that song? Huh? People use that as, a, like, a, as a sound on TikTok, I know. Oh, yeah, like no, that's, that's him. him, that's him. So oh. that, he's the original? He's the, the, yeah, the OG. Original. Well, mm -hmm. I love his, uh, his <laughs> Dark Souls armor. <laughs> yeah, he's giving me, uh, I don't know, man, this, this is a lot for me. There's a headdress. It's giving like Native American. Uh, is this cultural appropriation? I mean, it looks almost yeah, like. Yeah, I think he constantly gets canceled for that, but. He's on Native American land, I can tell you, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? He's out there ta tap dancing on their graves, tap dancing on a bench in a Native American burial ground. Have we considered he might be a ghost? He's hunting the park? <laughs> this is a ghost? Oh, really? <laughs> That's an interesting theory. He's definitely lip syncing. Deny my dear. Deny my dear. That outfit can't be easy to put together, though, I'll tell you, man. And he's been doing that for years. Like, yeah. 
10, 12 Hello, years back. Hello, my name is Richie from Social Repose, and I've avoided making this video for a very long time. About oh, a year okay. ago, I just... So why wearing a headdress is okay. So I, I, this is actually a conversation that's been happening apparently. I decided to put on this headdress and kind of make it part of my brand. And obviously it's ruffled a lot of feathers. Girls, Literally. Now, this is a serious uh, video. I, 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 gotta not, I gotta not make the jokes. And obviously when I put it on, I knew I was gonna get a lot of backlash. And even to this day, I still get a lot of messages. Oh, shit. I get a lot of hate. It's probably the source of most of my hate on YouTube went and there. my Facebook and all that. Just the occasional person coming in saying, Hey, did you know that's offensive and don't, I am offended? Come on, dude. Don't hit yeah, me. Don't do me like that. I understand where uneducated views are coming from. I get it. And I'm making this video to kind of explain where I'm coming from and why I'm not a terrible racist person and my reasonings for wearing the headdress and deciding that it's okay. Now in this video, I'm going to be sweeping over just pretty much the main argument that like 98% of people come at me with, um, which is, are you Native American? And if you're not, the headdress is reserved for war heroes or higher up what about chiefs this one? or essentially people <laughs> that have earned the right to wear it within their tribe. That's generally the main argument that I am presented with. I'm a lot of people that are of Native American descent um, or people that are just generally offended um, because they enjoy being offended at things. So before I address this multi-part argument, um, I have a little bit of a story. Um, I don't care. What's your argument? Here's the most washed part. Dennis Prager. Saying one is better than the other, they are just very different, which can be explained in the article below. Um, it's, it's pretty complicated in the differences, but you can read about it and it makes a lot of sense. Comparing me to wearing someone with a traditional Native American headdress is like comparing someone who is wearing the Medal of Honor to someone who went to a gift shop that bought a medal. Whatever. You know, good for him, I guess. Uh, he's he's very unique. Oh, look at this. A little imbop. <laughs> I'm smile fades in the summer. <laughs> Just a little Thanks fucking new age imbop. Imbop. Do it up, imbop. Get it, imbop. I'm to be doing like so tough. You know what I'm saying? They need to be moving as a unit. Right. Fade fells. Okay. We love it. He's out Boy, there like Sasquatch. Yeah, like what is with him standing on benches? I gotta ask. <laughs> <laughs> me up and stay white. Yeah. Wake me up and stay white. Yeah. Yeah. Stay me from the Okay. Okay. Social repost. So I don't know, but here's my fave. This dude, uh, this will be the last one, but this one's really good, you guys. Oh, where'd it go? <laughs> Here's an old school one. This Please dude, uh, pup is a song Puppies by Jay Bigga. <laughs> and he straight up drops the N word in it. And it's so wild, dude. It's fucking wild. Up, as high as you can, if she's worth it. Break her down and leave her for dead if she isn't. When you take her in your arms, is she all that you want? Is it real? Do you trust her? Does she trust you? When she takes your hand. Oh, dude, what the fuck? If that face looks at you offering you puppies, you fucking run, dude. Puppies in your what? Ooh. Puppies, puppies in my puppies. Oh, my God. This is such bad vibe. <laughs> so, okay, anyway, just to give you a taste, and then the most watched part. <laughs> right here. It's so out of pocket. <laughs> just like like for what reason dude why did you have to drop the hand bomb like no reason dude whoa that's awesome fuck yeah mm-hmm <laughs> pretty bold choice <laughs> you know 
What's next? Wearing a headdress? <laughs> what was the Rolo Tony dress set of N word, love? Right? Did Rolo Tony? I... Yeah. I dropped in WhatsApp. I'm, I'm, <laughs> that that was it. crazy. Rolo Tony Brown Town? Yeah. Yeah. I don't remember seeing that. I and everyone in... kind of looks around. What's that this morning? But because it's awkward. Whoa! I got Glenn Lawrence. I got uh, I got Red Pill Thor. <laughs> I got Ryan Stone. Thor. I got, Army. Army. I got Troy, and I have the man with the, the legend, uh, John Fitch, who's going to tell me how to chuck a nigga out. <laughs> so. Oh, dude! Yeah, what, was this recent? Yeah, you can. <laughs> it looks like it. This just did. This just happen. Look at the meeting of minds. Four days ago, yeah. You can kind of see people being a little bit taken aback of, of <laughs> a, a little bit. A few they people are, are like, what the fuck? Genuinely <laughs> shocked, yeah. How to chuck a nigga out. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, this is the only guy who's like, what? Uh, bridge. Rolo Tony, man, your age is showing, brother. And your racism. <laughs> when you were a kid, there probably was just straight up like slavery or. Yeah, something like that. 200. He is 200. <laughs> <Jeez>. So. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's bad. That is so painful. That's so I got Glenn Lawrence. I got, uh, I got Red Pill Thor. <laughs> I got Ryan Stone. Thor. I got, Army. Army. I got Troy. And I have the man with the legend, uh, John Fitch, who's going to tell me how to chuck a nigga out. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> That's a rough one, Rolo Tony. The double laugh too. He becomes quiet and then starts <laughs> laughing again <laughs> later. <laughs> He's a good man. We like Rolo Tony. No, we, we don't. We hate Rolo Fuck Tony. Rolo Tony. <laughs> Tony. <laughs> All my name is shit. He, 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 <laughs> he means well. He does not. <laughs> oh, right. 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 He doesn't. All right. Well, this has been a weird episode, but uh, I think it's time to go. Off the rails, baby. <laughs> So um, tomorrow is Leftovers. We're back. Friday is After Dark. Tomorrow, the Classics Collections dropping. So hope you guys all enjoy that. And uh, thanks, everyone, for watching. See you tomorrow.